Alrighty, hello y'all. Uh, welcome back to another episode of Candle Keep Mysteries, the sealed pages of Burglass. We are the Rollets of Fate. My name is Cisco Blanco. I am uh, Cody M in. Uh, I'm the Cody M, uh, as always. Uh, DM Cody M, uh, Tail Weaver, whatever, whatever. And as always, <laughs> uh, <laughs> next to me, the one and only, the incredible Mo. Hi, everyone. Hello. Welcome. Yeah, it doesn't pick up the sound. But yeah, uh, echo sound of audience. And as always, with us, our amazing adventurers as well, who once more find themselves in the far realm fighting for their lives. Uh, Andy, Joey, Luke, Lucky, Mark, and Rose. Hello. Say hello, y'all. Hello. 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 <laughs> Hello, yeah. Hello. That's a good one. You can scream as well as, as no, your characters if you want. Don't you dare watch it. Don't you dare watch it. Yeah. Uh, and today uh, we have a very special announcement just before our announcement. Uh, late, late, last second announcement. Happy birthday, Mark. Happy birthday. <laughs> Happy, birthday Happy birthday to our turtle. Happy, Happy birthday to you. Yep. Polite golf clap. Uh, <laughs> very nice I did yeah. exactly nothing to deserve it but thank yeah. you <laughs> many happy you were born. To you. that's that's yep. the main thing in the movie. that's the least ago. yeah um, <laughs> every human has done it it's not <laughs> it, just, it is not extra sure. it would be surprising if I wasn't born and I turned you know what? Six. then it was take, you know, everyone has at the, at the 12 inspirations so why don't you take an extra one just because it's your birthday i think that's kind of fair it's the only thing uh, we can give D24, you know? only okay, one extra no. yeah but I mean, D20, how old are you take a, take a normal <laughs> a full <laughs> inspiration <laughs> instead of a, a d12 just a d20 for you uh, for your birthday okay thank as you, you didn't have a lot of weeks without inspiration as well i think that makes sense <laughs> but he was yeah. hoarding uh, a while back <laughs> Yep. Uh, anyway, without further ado, I uh, pass it on to you more for the announcements. Thank you guys for. Yes, announcements time. If you are new to the stream and haven't watched any of our pre pre uh, previous episodes before, you can catch them all on our YouTube channel at Rollers of Fate DNT, where it uh, this campaign as well as our Sunday ca campaign, Dining in Barovia, uh, Wednesday campaign, the Eye of Observation, and our one shots. They're all there. So please go have a look. Tell your friends where to find us. Follow, subscribe, and uh, enjoy the show. Um, if you want to send us any uh, arts or anything, uh, messages, messages, please send it to our Gmail account, which is uh, rollersoffatednd at gmail.com, and our Twitter channel, which is at FateDND, where you catch up to date news and uh, other DD related stuff too. Uh, finally, content warning as always uh, if there's anything that you see on the screen you don't like, please step away. Hopefully, we've moved on from there once you have returned to the screen. Um, but apart from that i guess back to you cisco right fantastic thank you more for that um and thanks to all of you uh for being here playing with us also to everyone who's tuning in from home please make yourselves comfortable and settle in uh, and now let's see what mysteries shall be revealed today <laughs> Amidst murmuring eyeballs and otherworldly beings, an obelisk of power dominates the scene. The unliving expires, their souls he requires. Uncertain endings await beyond whimsical fate. Previously, in the sealed pages of Berglas, following the traveler's help plea, the caravan of chaos explored the swampy lands of Hither, under a perpetual twilight. Overcoming numerous obstacles, Haringon foes, and the randomness of the plain of fairy. Once the cock's performance pleased the ever wet hack Bablorma, and her brown waters exploration concluded, a deal to retrieve a dark book was made and a pair of magical scissors were lent to speed up the rescue mission. Guided by Sir Talabar, the group crossed the silvery mist that divides the fractured domain of Prismere, finding Aki's caravan remains, <clears throat> Moo the Kilmuli, 
and we moved the week the lily foot, both severely injured, as well as a magical emerald blade and a verdant sight blessed by the traveler. Hidden amidst the lifeless alien terrain of the silent peaks. Past a far realm crossing under the blackened waterfall, the party found themselves trapped in a glass chamber floating within a time warped wall space. In there, the archpriest of Vecna, Sadimos Fang, revealed his eldritch lich true form, and the group figured out during battle that he's performing a ritual to siphon life force from trapped souls and other victims from Aki's caravan, using an obsidian chronolith of power. And this is where a story continues tonight. You all find yourselves amidst combat in an spherical chamber, the floor and ceiling are made of arcane glass, and behind it you can see the fabric of space itself. In the middle, surrounded by seven dark circles, stands a 30-foot tall obsidian obelisk. Also in the chamber, there is Sadimus Fan. He's clad once more in a... I repeat the description. He's clad in a hooded midnight robes, He's got a gelatinous skin that is tight around his bones, and he has unnaturally long limbs ending in sharp claws. Also, as well as tentacles and a mouth full of jagged teeth that protrude from his gashed torso. Also, there, there is a few remaining uh, creatures around, uh, floating about, balloon-sized creatures, I believe. Uh, with multiple eyes and chicken-like feet, and you figure out that once per round you can cut, dispel, or potentially damage one of the magical sigils hidden underneath the black circles, or within the black circles, making Sanimo's regeneration less effective and stopping the shriveling effect on the creature's trap within. And yeah. And with all that said, uh, I think we should go back into the initiative. Cool, cool, cool. Let's get some spooky, horrendous, uh, mind-warping music, please. Uh, no? <laughs> <laughs> and yeah, uh, the as the initiative continues, uh, I am totally ready for this. One second, let me just open <laughs> this. Cool, cool, cool. Uh, let me see. My baby, where are you? My beautiful tentacled thing. Okay. Yep. He is right there. Okay. Uh, and he is uh, five feet on the air, uh, flying. So, us. Yeah. Okay, perfect. And he will, uh, Sadimus will take a legendary action actually before your turn, Yagu. Mm hmm. <laughs> and he is actually gonna use yeah why not let's be let's be horrible as uh, as he's getting to that point uh you will see that uh sadimo's hands start to kind of like move in the air and once more you will see that he points uh, in a direction where you a few of you are and you will see this ball of uh, lightning starts to crackle and this weird green greenish purple fireball starts to get bigger and bigger and bigger and I need uh, Ziggy, uh, Herald and uh, you um, Ruin to make a dexterity saving throw as a purple fireball explodes around you. Um, Goodbye, is boys. It, is it half? If it is it half damage if you fail? Yeah. Like yeah. All right then. Look, uh, I'm not making the save. If he's down. Oh no. I'm, I'm gonna use just, a I'm d. Not making the save. I'm okay. gonna use a d8 on this just, one uh, to also add to. This. Yeah. You have a d12. For today, oh, the, one, okay. the new one for today, the one from the D8 from last week is uh, is yeah, fired now. It's gone. It's 
bardic inspiration, no? It last yeah, yeah, no, no, the bard. I mean, I just thought you were using uh, inspiration we gave you last week. No, no, that's that's perfectly fine. Yeah. Please, uh, I was using the bardic inspiration. That's a uh, twenty-three for Harold. Twenty for Ruin. Okay. Uh, twenty for Ruin. Twenty-three for Harold. So you both actually are successful. Uh, in that case. So mm -hmm. you will take half damage. Uh, should I roll it, or do you guys want to do average? Uh, uh, it's up to you. Roll. It's uh, however you want to do it. Okay. The roll is better. All right, so I'll roll. There's always a chance for lower. Okay. Yeah, actually, you were I mean, right. It's if, lower if, than the average. If uh, you're able to low roll them one hit point, then I'm, oh no. I'm still up. But okay. yeah, other than that, no. So the average will have been 32, but you, however, take uh, 20, 26 uh, is the the number, so half will be 13. So 13, 13 right, points fine. of radiant damage is not fire, it's a uh, Oh, unique. it's radiant? Yes, um, it's radiant. I will use my... Is it a reaction to use... Um... You tell me. The gift from Barry. Uh, it says minor moonstone, common magical item, no attunement, thrice per day, reaction. Oh, it is reaction. They become yeah. resistant to radiant damage, so I'll take no damage. Resistant. Actually, you'll still take half of 13. Half, so. yeah, half oh, of I thought if you do. Oh, yeah, because it's a. Uh... Never mind. Yeah, yeah, I understand. No, no, but it's still. Uh, you only take five. And it says it's. Actually, 13, 5, 6. Mm -hmm. As per uh, absorb element spell. Oh, okay. So you take uh, half radiant, and you also have uh, just check the absorb element spell. I think it's a d6 radiant for your next attack. Uh, that it goes Ooh. extra there. It's like a melee nice. attack, though. It's not like a spell attack. If I remember yeah. Melee. So how? So as you kind of like clutch this gift from Barry, uh, for a second you smell uh, a very strong smell of pineapple pizza. Has somehow <laughs> <laughs> for a second around you, and then uh, you become resistant to it. So yeah, you take six points instead of uh, third, uh, instead of uh, twelve, right? Yeah, uh, I said yeah. eleven. I can't remember. Yeah, 13, 13. 13. yeah, six points. Six. All right, and, and that will yeah, and that will finish Sadimo's legendary action. He stares at you with the scissors, Bruce, once more. And that uh, will finish. Yago, we move. The camera moves to you as you are there uh, on the side, and you see your friends Siggy just collapses on the floor, unconscious. Oh boy, here I go heating again. And Choco will tip up over here, mm -hmm. and he will use his telekinetic shove to shove uh, Ziggy five feet towards him. I prefer to this location if possible. Yeah, perfect. Always, I always wonder. Uh, yeah, I think we already discussed this, but it only counts as for force. Is is count as willing movement only if you use your reaction, right? Otherwise, it's force movement, so there is no opportunity attacks, uh, right? Oh, okay, only if you are willing as well, I believe. If you are like, oh yeah, pull me out of this place, and he says, oh yeah, I'm willing, because normally he has to make a roll, but mm. now he doesn't have to make roll because he's down. Mm. Yeah, yeah. I believe that's okay. also part of the rule, but not sure. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I think I, I think as per the rule anyway, only when you are forced to use your reaction, then you provoke opportunity attacks. If yeah, I think there's not, only a couple of spells that do that, like yeah. Dissonant mm -hmm. Whispers. Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah I think it's only two or three, yeah. Cool, cool. So yeah, you, Siggy, uh, uh, in your in, un half unconscious state between life and death, you roll and you feel be moved somehow. And then I move over here. And I can't remember if I'm still raging or not because last turn I didn't I take any damage. You, I think you did attack though, so you should be raging. Yeah, like did. you, you did it in between yeah, the attacks. Yeah, in that case, I will use my lay of hands to uh, restore your four with one hit point, Siggy. Woohoo! Oh wow! Be happy that I still have one. <laughs> <laughs> lay of hands. Every every little help. Yeah, I guess. Fine. I guess. And then, right. uh, yeah, that's the end of my turn. What else I can do? Okay. All right, perfect. So, yeah, uh, fantastic. Uh, as this is happening, uh, we move to the corner of the room where there has been a Zadimos staring at you with hatred on his eyes. Bruce, what would you like to do? Uh, Bruce immediately goes, Wait, hold on! And pulls out a small oh. white flag. 
Truce, just for a second. There's something I gotta do, D Mr. Fang. You are funny. Thank you. Right, excuse me one second. <laughs> right, Yagu, listen to me. I know there's someone through there listening. I want to wish him a happy birthday. <clears throat> happy birthday to you. Happy <laughs> birthday to you. You look like a tortoise and... You smell like You one. smell like one too. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Hey, the thank you very much. Right. The Doku is staring yeah. at the face like, what the fuck is a birthday? <laughs> 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 Bruce Reese is back. He's like, thank you very much, Mr. Fang. We may resume hostilities. Puts the flag away. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right, then. <laughs> sure. Right, thank Today's you very much. Today's a day but... of birth and death. Why not? Hey, sure, for you. you're a poet and you didn't even know it. <laughs> Right, Shrek okay. his shoulders, disgusting gelatin, <laughs> gelatin bony shoulder. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, okay, enough of my bullshit now. Uh, so, question: I'm still hasted. So, um, can I take a couple of swings at him, and then run like hell over to here to use the scissors? Yeah, yeah, I don't see why not. So you. I mean, you uh, were you were already in this one. Did you not want to use it in this one? I've already freed them now. No, you haven't. No, you yeah. haven't. No, yeah, not. Not I thought I had. No, no, okay, yeah. then. No, uh, in that case, one. in that case, I will go. Zadimus, you god, still a bitch, <laughs> and free them. All right. Oh, I... you see him like screaming and shouting and more. Uh, I go ahead. No, 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 it's fine. Uh, yeah, as you kind of go up to go up to the point, you see it right there. So uh, potentially you move. Five feet, ten feet, um, and then as you use the scissors, you you see him looking like, "What are you doing?" And as it hits the uh, sigil itself, you see the the tether that is connected to this black circle to the uh, ob uh, obelisk um, uh, kind of snip, and a, like a magical tendril just gets whipped back. And as he sees that coming, you see Zadimus Fang screech, and you also see make a perception check as you look at him. Mm -hmm. Poor thing. Oh boy, here I go perceiving again. Where are you? 19. That's more than enough. You see him wince in pain as that happens. And yeah. immediately you see the the kind of the, the the spirits of the dwarven people underneath they glow a little brighter. Although they're not kind of uh, cannot they're not as um, uh, corporeal. Vital. Oh, uh, yeah, meaning they, they they don't notice you in here. They're just kind of floating around, but they they seem to be kind of much more uh, m much more corporeal, like uh, Cisco said hmm. as well. And immediately you see him kind of scream, let out this kind of uh, magical energy, and the other four wait, how many? Five remaining kind of get locked off um, the sigils and they are protected by a barrier for the rest of this round. So this one is broken now, so that's two down. Yeah, uh, I'll just add to that uh, as well with that perception check, you see that uh, everything that Mo described and also you notice that Sadimo's hand, the flesh on it kind of like falls off him and you see parts of his bones and you realize that this stopping the ritual is actually making him much weaker. It's not only stopping his healing, it's actually making him his flesh fall off. <laughs> and he's like, oh, you, you are going to die right now. <laughs> your turn, you, know, you know, the thing about that, Mr. Fang, you got to catch me first. And I'm going to use one of, the, one, of my, one of my extra actions to disengage so that I can make a direct line to here. Oh, I mean, on. you're not in yeah, you're now, not in it's up to you, though. No, but it's I, 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 if I want to avoid, I have to get around him, which I don't think I can. Um, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, no, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 60, 70, 75, 80. I'm going to take an opportunity attack from the hand, I think, if I want to get to Errol to help him. He's going to get opportunity attacks. Oh, yeah, grappling, so he can't attack me. Okay, fair enough then. And that should be fine then. Uh, okay, here we go. Um, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35. The hand is an object, I remember we looked it up. 
And does it have reactions? It doesn't, right? No. We, we already okay, said that. Too, yeah. I'll check anyway. But yeah, check the spell if you don't mind. 70, 75, 80, 85. Okay. Okay. And you move all around Sadimos in a way that you don't take opportunity. That is, well. that is yeah, why yeah, I, I, I yeah, he did However, this. He yeah, did this. <laughs> so I'm continuing just I'm continuing my smack talk of him who have said, Animus, fuck you and uh, mm -hmm. I'm now gonna take uh, a couple of swings at uh, I have two swings left for this guy, don't I? Or is it do yeah. I get three attacks? No, you something. get two because you use your extra action to yeah. use the scissors, so yeah, you get your normal correct. action. That is mm -hmm. correct, that is correct. Yeah. Okay, I am gonna swing recklessly because I really wanted to get this thing off of you. So, Thank where you. are you? Gut wrencher. Let's go. 16. You have a D12 in case it doesn't hit, but it should. Yeah. Sticking to 16? Uh, oh, you're not going to tell me. Oh, bugger. Okay, I guess I'll. Stick. I've, I I've hit one. I trust you. They are balloons, like. Stick. I'm going to stick. That hits. Oh, thank God! <laughs> uh, 16 damage. 16 is not enough. It is on one HP. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Are you? Can I just like spit on it and? <laughs> Please, I'm begging you to save my ass here. <laughs> oh my God! Save your ass! Hit point. Ah! I. Oh. I am on five. Do you have any? Do you have. Uh, no, you I'm can't use attacking it. Attacking again. I'm attacking again. Rex attack. Okay, it's dead now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I had no extra bits to throw at it, so. That's the worst I've rolled in attacks for a while. Well, uh, to my life. Yeah. <laughs> and with that. All right. A plume of smoke, but you are all immune to poison, and nothing happens. Okay, I've got 50 feet of. No, 5 feet of movement left. I say, everyone, we keep on dispelling those things, get free in these folk. He's getting weaker. And I'm going to use that. And uh, as you move away, ruins in that one. <laughs> and right. he points to the one next to him. That's the next one. Oh, I, I, and again, I'm, I'm turning to Zadamus. I'm just like, you can't get me. <laughs> trying to get all his attention on me. Mm -hmm. Okay. Your friends die all around you, and you still action. feel joy. You fools. You will never escape this chamber. Have you finished your turn, Bruce? Uh, that is... Uh, I have a bonus action left. Yeah, I do, actually. I've got my... Oh, like I'm going to... Oh, I can't do anything else for anyone else, so... Remember, you, Could can, I... you can still step inside the, the, the thing. It's just the sigils are locked. so you, you... No, that's fine. That's yeah, fine. I've, got, I, I've used my, five, my last five foot of movement speed there. Mm -hmm. uh, I have two regular potions of healing. Could I just like give one to somebody else? Or is that like an action to give someone you, the potion? You could, put it, you could put it on the floor for them to pick up. Uh, giving it to someone, it will be... Oh. Actually, I guess you could put it on his hand, yeah? That will be an interaction, yeah? Sure. I could just uh -huh. drop it next to him then, as, as an interaction. Okay, then. I'll <sighs> drop... Uh, you I'll can drop just a... give it to them, actually. on their, Put it on their pocket or something I like that. I can't physically give it to Ruin, because I've used up. I used my action, I believe. Okay, okay. So... But you can, you know, and it you will can be give an it interaction. administering. Yeah. 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 You cannot okay. pour it into his mouth, but you can just handle it. That's fine. It to so, him. interaction to drop one of them next to Errol, and so it's like it's where it's the square I'm sitting on right there. And so, if that's my interaction, can I use my bonus action to neck my last one? Sure. Okay, so. That's nice roller. Uh, 2d4 plus 2, isn't it? Uh, yes, sir. Oh, superb. Eight health. Okay, that is me done. All right. Uh, Siggy, uh, I mean, uh, yes, yeah, Siggy and Errolt, uh, please roll d20 each, just to keep it quick. Uh, sure. Okay. Um, yeah. okay. Whoever rolls the lowest will be targeted by Zadimus. Oh, fuck. <laughs> no. <laughs> Why is he ignoring me? I'm the one with the scissors and freeing because everyone. Because he's in because he wants to he knows that if he keeps killing God. the people who are low in it, health no. uh, he will be more effective to stop you kind of thing oh shit all right so as the as he focus on the two of you and extend his hands uh one more Errolt and yagu you both feel like this 
silvery flames start to materialize underneath your feet. I need you to make a dexterity saving throw as he casts unholy flames on you two. Fuck. With your five feet of each other. Ooh, what? nice. Damn it, I'm still... Okay, you both save. Mm -hmm. uh, however, you both take half damage. That is 11 points of necrotic damage. All right, nice. I am down, gents. Down? Yep, oh, that knocked me down again, yep. Mark the both little cross again, actions. I'm sorry. Yeah. No yeah. worries. But he doesn't have any more legendary actions, if that makes you feel any better. Yeah, all uh, right. And it's your turn, Herald. Let me get the D20 out of the way. Uh, is there a way that I could... Oh, here it is. Damn it. Oh, wait, no, it went to public. No, I'm sorry. It's fine. It's no fine for worries. now. It's, That's it's, okay. It's okay. Yeah. I... God damn it, D&D Beyond. Should I roll it again, no, or no. should I just... No, no, it? that's fine. No worries, sir. That's Close. Cool. Almost yeah. a 20. Yeah. That was, that's the end of the turn. I'll put the cross for you guys. Whoever is unconscious, uh, yeah. That's yeah. only him. It's only no me. Worries. I think uh, Ziggy's yeah. still up. Okay. Cool, cool. And I will finish uh, Errol's turn as you are there. Uh, between life and death, thinking of what is going to happen to your friends, what's going to happen to you. What is this all means? And Ruin, uh, it's your turn, as you are still kind of like grappled by this hand that keeps squashing your wings, you feel its pressure there. It looks identical to the hand of Vegna, even though you've never seen the hand of Vegna on character, uh, mm -hmm. golden and stuff. Uh, what would you mm -hmm. like to do? Uh, quick question, is it an action to try and break the scrapple, correct? Uh, let me just check the spell. Um, I believe so, but let me make sure. Grasping hand, is that the one I'm using? Yes, the yeah. attempts to grapple. Da, da, da. Uh -huh. da, da, da. The target. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Okay, I should have had advantage on the check because you are smaller, but I missed that part. That's fine. Uh, you can. Da, da, da. Mm. It doesn't say anything about. Yeah, so it will be a normal grapple, I guess. That's why it doesn't say anything. So it will be... It is an action to break a grapple. Uh, it is... Uh, okay. My next question... One of your I... attacks to start a grapple, I believe. My next question, if I enlarge myself, will I break out of its grapple? Ooh. Uh, if you Something manage... Large. Uh, I mean, now you are medium, right? Because uh, that's what we established. Or are you small? I forgot what we established. Uh, I guess I'm technically medium. That's what we established. Uh, yeah, is that correct, Mo? As well, I you don't said know. I you said I was medium, but I didn't um, use the small, the tiny rules. Okay, uh, all right. Uh, if that's the case, you will be the same size than, than it, so you will have to be a size larger for you to break the grapple. And if I make I myself smaller, I'm then just curious, it will like be even easier for him because okay. he says he he has advantage <laughs> on a smaller cre or medium creature, so he that should have had advantage that's, on you. That's all I needed to know. Um, but I, I won't will... be an asshole, so you're not gonna have this advantage to try to escape or anything. But yeah, I will. Hmm. I'll stay in its grip and I'll just use guiding bolt at first level, and I'm gonna throw it at um, Zadimus. Okay. okay, perfect. Just a, just a heads up. The, and I'm actually going to twin spell it, and I'm going to hit the hand that's holding me. Okay. Uh, remember, the absorb element D6 radiant is only on melee attacks. So, just a heads up uh, on that. Oh, is it? Uh, I wasn't sure. It is, yeah. It's part of the spell. It's one of those weird okay. catch wings. And it, will, it, will, it disappears if you don't use it this turn as well. And it's disadvantage to hit the thing that's grappling you. No, no. With this. Oh, yeah, it's true. It's oh, yeah, he's twinning it. Then. Melee attack. Am oh, I yeah, if he's twinning it, yeah. It if I'm grappling it? The hand, yeah. No, no. Then no, I will no, use. If I, I'll just use melee attacks. I'm going to use the Serpent's Fang, and I'm going to just repeatedly jab into the, the fingers. Yeah. Okay. All right, first attack. So um, you're going to go melee, yeah, to the hand then? Instead. Yeah, I'm hitting up the Serpent's okay. Fang. Perfect, yeah, so 22, 22 hits, yeah. And then I'm just going to do the second to hit. Okay, uh, perfect, just do the second attack too. Damn it, I wish I hex... Oh, oh nice. Oh, this could have okay. hurt Zadimus. Yeah, you hit uh, twice. Uh, you see the hand contorts as you hit it. 
in a way, even and though... both of these were going to be uh, two-handed slashes. Okay. Perfect. Remember the additional poison damage, if yep, that makes yep. any difference. That's so this is... That does nothing. These are both the regular um, D10s, and then two additional D10s for poison, right? Yeah. Well, one per swing, yeah. Okay, is it... Okay. So it's two T10 plus five per swing. Plus two D turns at Under D6, I, I guess, for the Radiant. Jesus Christ. Oh yeah, and the D6. <laughs> I'm rolling so terribly on the poison rolls. If it's a construct, it might be immune anyway. Oh, oh my god. Uh, 20, 23. It doesn't, I don't think it says it's immune 20. to poison, is it? No. Uh, that's what I'm checking actually. I'm checking the spell. So it doesn't say anything spell, about it. So, so. so mm -hmm. 23 points. The hand has an object. No. no. Uh, so yeah, let's say it's not. Yeah. No, no immunities or resistance. So 18, 90, 20, so 21, 20, 23 points of damage on that. Oh, nice. Yeah, you see. Out of date. Yeah. yeah. Two ones and two twos. You and see, you kind of like. Clip a tiny portion of one of his nails with that attack. <laughs> like, it looks oh, shorter like now, it was a bit too long, one of them. Bonus action, I will... Nothing I could do. No bonus actions. That's it. Alright. So then, um, as you do those two attacks and stuff, the camera will move to another round that we need to count, actually. Let me just yep. do that. Or new. New so round. round five, actually. Ooh. We're on oh. round five, yeah. Yeah. Wow. All right. So top of the round uh, is you once more, uh, Ziggy. Yeah. All I can you do are, is um. You are prompt. You, I believe you were unconscious on your last turn, right? No, not yet. Yeah. I, I was unconscious, but then I was. Okay. No, I, I was brought. I was, One I was point back, back up. Well, I, I was brought back, and it hasn't been my turn since going okay, unconscious. Okay. So, so what, what would you have in your hands uh, when you went unconscious? Nothing. What would really. you have been holding? Okay, cool. So yeah, then nothing. you don't need to pick um, up anything, so that you can stand up if you want. Yeah. So, just gonna stand up, and all I can do is bonus action, healing words, herald, and main if, action. Uh, if you don't want to waste the spell slot, there's the potion right there, but it's up to you. But you would no, need to use an action. No, because I want to heal myself as well. Okay. So uh, I'm going to second level healing word him. Okay. If that works. Okay. Uh, yeah, okay. so 14 points of healing with my bonus action. Thank you. And then I'll heal myself with a greater potion of healing. I believe I have one. Yes, I do. Did that awesome. roll? Nope. Nice. Oh. Of course, Hooray. I did well on That's my a good roll, healing. Actually. Yes, but of course, it's not on the healing that matters. Actually, it all matters. We all need to stay up. <laughs> Help me. Yeah, but the damage dealer needs it all. Uh, let me get rid of this cross if I can while I'm at it. Yeah. There we go. That's, that's right. my turn. All right. Fantastic. Um, as uh, you finish your turn, uh, next will be Sadimos Fun. Uh, you see these ghastly creatures floating, kind of like his feet are down, like as he floats and moves around the crystal glass of this chamber. And he will fulfill your uh, beckoning, uh, Bruce. He will move himself kind of in this unnatural way and place himself here behind you. Still uh, now at the... At the at your level, kind of, uh, mm -hmm. for now. Actually, one second. He, let me does just... that mean he's a, he's like just just mm, hovering yeah. off the ground? Yeah, just wait one second. Let me just make sure. No, he's gonna he's gonna be 15 feet up um, this time. So if you could change the little marker for me, more because I'm in the to do, please, if you don't mind. Uh, while I do some attacks, and he will focus his attacks on you, uh, Bruce. He will start with uh, his main tentacle. You see, like, the biggest tentacle that he kind of, like, protrudes from his chest. Will try to stab I, you. I got you. I got you. Okay. It's very, um, very long. Yeah. Um, yeah. I'm sorry for that. That is a very long natural 20 on that. 
Uh, does any of you have Lucky? Lucky? That's it. No. Yeah, actually, <laughs> no. no, it's only you. Oh, no. Okay. Uh, I'm sorry, Andy. Okay. Uh, as he hits you, uh, let me roll it because otherwise it's too unfair. I don't want to do average on this because it's a lot of damage. Uh, so it's 9d6. Is Ziggy up? Or is and it that would be that Ziggy's up. Um, I'm, I'm sorry, my Sandekish, but getting rid of that extra legendary resistance is more important. I get you. I don't worry about it. Yeah. So you, it will be half because uh, your rage. So it will be 39 points of damage, half already. <sighs> Fucking hell. And that will be necrotic and piercing. Not that it makes a difference. And uh, I need you to make a wisdom saving throw. You have advantage on this because the hero's fist. As you feel him kind of like the tentacle itself in the moment he poked you, you feel it like in your mind, like it's there. I have a, I have a problem on my keyboard. Now the number two key is stopped working. Oh no. <laughs> uh, do you want one of us to... Uh, I'll, I'll, you I'll, want, I'm, I does... apologize. I put it at 30 just now, so it's only one hit point off. I'll try my best to remember. Wait, is it 31 or 29? 29? Okay, I can adjust yeah, more. Yeah. Um, can you uh, open right. a digital keyboard? Oh, oh, thank. It's working now. Um, never okay. mind. So, cool, um, cool. wisdom save. Advantage. I remember. I remember. Do you have a D12 in case this goes I terribly? Know, I know. 21. Never mind. Oh, okay. Yeah, 21 is enough. Uh, actually, it was meant to be charisma, so just... Uh, you can either keep that roll or you can re-roll my opponent. Wait a minute, hang on. No, no, it is wisdom, you, sorry. Charisma yeah, because you attacked me last it. session no, no, and it yeah, was yeah. a wisdom. Uh, the, <laughs> the, the, other the one two is, attacks the other together. One. Yeah, the one that is coming now uh, oh. is the one that is charisma. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah. So as he finishes with the tentacle, the tentacle retracts back. Uh, you are fine. For a second, you feel like this curse was about to exhaust you, but you managed to overcome it. Oh, After that, nice. you will feel his voices within your head as he uses psychic whisper on you. Okay, that's a 15 that's, uh... on the die for 26 to hit. As he hits you, you will feel this psychic damage entering your mind this time. One second, one more roll. Okay, uh, so that's tw 24 points of psychic damage, and I need you to make a charisma saving throw. As you yeah. feel the whispers are sailing to you, don't move, stay still. You don't have to move. Freeze. You do uh, have a D12. I would suggest adding it. I am going to add it. I will suggest that too. <laughs> What a terrible roll. Uh, 19. Would be good enough. Okay. Uh, yeah, 19 is enough. Uh, you feel for a second like a stun. You are feeling stunned, but you managed to overcome it. Also, as well, it's 20 points, but it's not reduced, so it will be reduced to 10. Yeah. So you mark it. I think you mark too much. Uh, if it's, it's psychic fault. damage, then. Oh, no yeah, it's psychic. Yeah, it's not reduced. Man, they are all dumb. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Cool, cool. And then, right, uh, look, I'm looking bad now, boys. That's what you wished for, didn't you? Drop the scissors on the floor and I'll pick them up from your corpse. You and then as he's talking, you <laughs> And you see he, the hand squashes Ruan. Maybe I can make your friends suffer instead. Oh, that's uncomfortable. And as he squashes you, let me just make sure if this happens automatically. Oh. Uh, da, da, da. Would you permit me to try something? This might make no difference. This is purely flavor. And, uh, yeah, yeah, please. Go Ruin, ahead. Can, Ruin can roll an insight if he wants to. You make me roll something. I, I, I look to. Bruce looks to Ruin, spits out some blood, and goes, He's not my friend. You can have him as much as you want. Mm. Oh, no, I don't want to insight that. I want that to be. Yeah. <laughs> uh, if it's what I think. It is, this guy looked at it. It's two d six plus your spellcasting modifier automatically. There's no yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, no, he's gonna I don't try. Know if Change his mind or not? I want to see if Zadamus will do something with, uh, and try and incite me as well. So <laughs> he just uh, looks at you with a scorn, Bruce, kind of thing, and he will try to use uh, clench fist on you uh, this time. Oh, never mind. 
just to give you to hurt you even further. So that will be twenty three to hit. On who? On you, uh, Ruin. That is still grapple within his class. The clasp of the hand. Fuck! 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 That hits. Could you All stop right. rolling well, Cisco? Please. I know. I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> you just need to stop. Uh, okay. So that will be. Let's see. Okay, that's not too bad. Uh, 18 points of force damage. I see the the hand squashes you. Do you do? Did you just do clench fist? Yes. Okay. So and you, I did the, uh, the roll to hit. The grap the grapple ends if that's the case. No, no. Yeah, I think it stays there, right? No, cause one of the following effect with it. So yeah. I'm free. free. No, that's if he decides to use that one. Yeah. Well, you did. I took the damage. So grass oh, hand ends bad. and then he punches him. Yeah. Oh, let's <laughs> let's be let's be nice. Uh, I, I think that's I think that's how like that. because he can't he can't, he can't, he can't, gra- nice. he can't I, I hold mean, him and punch him because he's holding him. Is it being nice yeah. or is it the rules? You yeah. know, it's like <laughs> I mean he doesn't say he breaks the grapple, but yeah. Otherwise he'll it's say terms. you cannot attack unless if you attack some other target or if you yeah, attack, you know, because I'm attacking also, the same target. It doesn't matter. It doesn't and the, they don't, wait, what did, which one did you say? That was your backwards. Right? So he was in the grasping hand beforehand. Grasping hand, yeah. And then the he hand just did the clench grapples, fist. yeah. And then... Ta, ta, ta. Yeah, okay. He's cool. Uh, all right. I'll, I'll, so I'll check it up anyway. But, no, yeah. no, let's say that he's free. It doesn't matter anyway. And that will, uh, I think, uh, yeah, that will be it. Uh, Sadimos Funk will just stare at you. As, yeah. Uh, actually, let's make it a bit harder. Can I also move the hand? Yeah, no? And as part of the same thing, right? Two, two, two. Let me just make sure. You can move the hand 60 yeah. feet. Yeah. And then Koso, he's gonna bring you back out. So he's gonna move you 60 feet all the way upwards. Yeah. Uh, I know you're not grapple, actually. Fuck that. Okay. I was gonna say, you I should have done that it, before. It, yeah. It, let, it does let go of the grapple. Okay. All right. Okay. So yeah, because uh, you so don't have he'll... to use the action to crush me. Yeah. Uh, the bonus so then, to crush. so then uh, he w- the hand will just move around. Uh, I guess if it's an object, it doesn't provoke opportunity attacks neither, right? Otherwise, uh, it doesn't uh, feel fair. Well, it's because uh, it's probably actually not, it doesn't the... matter. Uh, take an opportunity attack, uh, Ruin. Please. Wait, you I used your reaction already. You used it to do the absorb well, elements. I used it before my turn. Oh yeah, that's the point. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I used it before my turn. That was. I but was the end of the you, round. You need yeah, your yeah. turn to restore your reaction back, though. It comes That's back what your I did. turn. I had my yeah. turn. So I used bef- uh, absorb elements before yeah, yeah. my turn. He, he my you got your reaction. Yeah, 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 yeah. No worries. Okay. So yeah, this I'm is my reaction. reaction. Okay. And how high? Actually, you will what? still be five feet. 22? In the hmm. uh, oh, yeah. Sure. 22 hits as the hunt um, scurries away. <laughs> He kind of turns for a second and kind of does this thing to you when you hit it. Uh, it takes 14 points of damage. Okay, 14 points. You, you, you're a HP guy, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, okay. yeah. Thank you, sir. Oh, oh thank God. 14. Yeah, and I will finish that. Uh, after that, we move to the lair action. All right, oh. lair action time. Guess what, Ruin? It's thing. your turn. No, Go ahead, Lucky. <laughs> Roll a d6. Oh, no. oh damn. Uh, oh, okay. Oh, b- before oh, we missed it. It's fine. We'll co- we'll we'll come around. Whoa, what is it? What is the it? drain thing, I think. Six. The drain. Well, that's a good thing, right? The draining draining health. Um, yeah, okay. six was bad. To lucky. So, so let's oh, do shit. it. Oh shit! Six fine. is bad. Take six health away. Yeah. <laughs> you Here see comes the balloons again. You see Zadimus. Um, uh, you see Zanimus like rip his chest even more and tentacles begin coming out and as they do they just fly out um, detaching from his body and you begin to see these kind of parasitic tentacles kind of latch onto the ground uh, next to you and kind of stand up as if they're the living creatures and they immediately as they do they're going to whack each of you one Ooh. time. Uh, uh, sh- give me one moment. I'm gonna shift them around oh, and r- reveal them as nice. I kind of go along. The fat lady's warming up her voice now, boys. Awesome. Yeah, I'm getting one each again. We have an image. I'm just we? confused real quick. Yeah, I rolled the sure. six. Do oh, I take six damage? No, yes. it's six is this effect. We no, all get six is that effect. Yeah, oh, okay, but you okay. take damage uh, on the. Yeah, did we do that actually? We didn't do the no. healing. We forgot. We forgot. Oh. Yes. Okay, so let's say. 
the because it's technically still layer action action, so we should do it really. It's, okay, go ahead. Yeah. Damn it. So you I take. So you, uh, I'll yeah, I'll, you I'll describe it for me, please, uh, if you don't mind. You take five points of damage, necrotic damage. Yep. Oh, this is hurting. Uh, yeah, and and I'll give him the image now, so they can see what it looks like. <laughs> So it looks like one of those jellyfish, like the Portuguese uh, calavera is called in Spanish, actually. The uh, Portuguese man over it. Yeah. These are not edible? Just a head. Just a, just a, yeah. Uh... Oh, they're fun to play with, though. <laughs> well, <laughs> depends what well, you're into, I guess. I don't know. No, 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 no. Mm, tactical. And this, is a, <laughs> and this is a melee attack on me, right? So they have advantage because I'm on the ground. Well, let's find out. Let me see. What what, what do they have? Uh, yeah, uh, what do they immediately do? I can't remember. They use the... Um, uh, one second. I have it here. Consume life? Yep. Yep. It says on the layer action itself. Let's just see. I think I'd rather go back to the other realm. Um, if it's... Which one? If the consume life reduces hit points by like their maximum, it can't because the hero's feast. Got mm. you. Yeah, yeah. Whatever Ravenloft was in, or whatever. Yeah. Forget. Oh, okay. No. I got a, I got a cling, cling, cling yeah, first. Or cling. Yeah. Cling, yeah, yeah I got a, I got a cling first. So these things try to kind of, as they fly at you, try to attach themselves to you. So uh, let's go one by one. Uh, let's go to Aki Flemicaster first. Cling attack. That's a natural one. It misses. Uh, <laughs> the one to you, Ruin, comes flying towards you. That's a seven. It misses. Oh, <laughs> the wow. one next to <laughs> Ziggy. Uh, you are standing up, so you're fine. I love it when Mo rolls. That's a 21. Yeah, um, it, that'll do. Also, I think I was thinking of something else. We can have our hit points reduced. Okay. Uh, yeah. Uh, creature can reach as an action. Okay, yeah. So you can attempt to try to remove it, but for now, it is stuck to you, and you take ten points of necrotic damage. All right. Yeah, right. This is technically a grapple effect when they, gra when they grab on. Yeah. Uh, no, you can move. It's more like he's grappling to you. It's a tiny thing. So yeah. yeah. Yeah, it's a tiny, okay. tiny little thing. Um, and this one is to you, Yagu. So take this with a 16, which misses. No! Uh, ha -ha. Uh, it just slides off your shell. Like, uh, um, too, too greasy. Yeah, Harold, <laughs> this one, this one's coming at you. Uh, it is a melee weapon, so it will have advantage. On 18 AC. Uh, yeah, so I'll just roll it twice, because uh, I don't know which one I rolled. Uh, 19. Ugh. Damn, damn. Okay. Uh, so it hits you with advantage. You take, oh, that's, I think, max damage. Uh, 15 points of damage. Oh, take damage. I am down again, boys. All right. And then one to you, Brucey boy. That's a 14 to hit. Misses. All right. Okay. And you see them kind of one attached onto Herald and the other one attached onto when uh, I I think the way we made it, I think if new monsters appear, the the old one goes right. I think yeah, I think that's so. That's how it's meant to be. Uh, and then the other ones just go poof and disappear. So the goon balloons. The goon balloons leave. pop. Pop. Yeah. <laughs> all right. Cool, cool. Uh, all right. Oh, I think I like the goon balloons yeah. more. Yeah. If you could just click on the stream image more and just see stuck in oh, there. Oh, it's just stuck. There you go. Yeah, I have adjusted no it. That's it. And that's the cool, layer cool. action done. All right. Amazing. Just to ask, uh, you see that when uh, when Sadimos found, uh, on the at the end of his turns, he kind of like uh, raises his hands and you feel uh, like a force, like almost like a life force is sucked from all these victims on these black circles around him and that's when you feel it as well ruin like your heart stops for a second and as you all see that sadimos heal himself and uh gives you damage uh in there you haven't rolled him more did you uh, yeah, yeah he's taken the yeah yeah okay yeah yes. so just, just re-describing it okay and that will be the end of that 
So once all that is finished, uh, we, the camera moves towards you, Aki, as you are there on the top uh, north uh, east yep. of the map. <laughs> what would you like to do? Uh, I'm going to do... Okay, I think it might be Hail Mary time. Um, Aki is going to run down to 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, to here, taking the opportunity attack. Okay. I assume. Yeah. That's a 22 uh, to hit. Yes, that hits me. So you take 14 points of necrotic damage, and now it's uh, tagging along with you. Grand. Um, I'm going to uh, to start with. I'm going to twin spell a vortex warp and blast Errol and Bruce out of there. Okay. So I'm going to grab them and deposit them over here, where I'm pinging. No, 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 no! Please don't. Not me. No. I want Not to you? free Druin because I think that could be a big, de a big help for him specifically. Okay. But okay, you know then I'm. Then I'll move Ruin, or Ruin Prime. Do I have to consent to Vortex War? Actually, you know what? I'll take it. You can fail so, to it, or you can refuse it. So, who is it? Ruin no, I'm gonna, I'm gonna take it. So I'm gonna, yeah, Errol and Ruin, I'll blast over here, to okay. the other side of the uh, the main map. So like, right here? Yeah, there yeah. thereabouts. And then Ruin, and, uh, um, you wanna move your token? Yeah, you are yeah. conscious, Errol? Yep. Okay. Yeah, it's, it, it, it doesn't and, have the same rules as Polymorph, so I can move, I, I can move, yeah. I can move any creature. Yeah. Errol's down. So uh, yeah. Could you um, put the cross Errol for yourself, oh, please? Okay. Sorry. Yep. I, I should do that. Okay. Now, Otherwise, um, I might hear you when you're down <laughs> with my mistake. You know. Point okay. of order, I'm going, go. to I'm going to display the spell here, and it says, around another creature you can see within range. It does not say that I have the ability to blast things that might have leached onto those creatures so you can target it, 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 it is a creature uh so yeah but if i move errol my point is if i target errol specifically does errol go and leaves his wee pal behind no he's attached to him so he's just gonna go with it unfortunately okay. never mind <laughs> good, good shot, good shot whatever whatever errol actually errol uh what did you have anything in your hand that is potentially I... could have fall off of you when you went I, had my, I had my bow in my hand, so I'm assuming the bow is still there in that spot, yeah, but that's fine. Bow. We can figure that out. Make a drawing, actually, there, and the bow will be yeah. there. Okay. I'm and then gonna... um, Aki's going to, going to, standing where he is, yeah. he's going to shout uh, to everybody south of him, The coat! I'm using the coat! And hoping everyone remembers what the coat does. Do no. I get to tell them what the coat does? <laughs> <laughs> They've seen it. We've all make seen an, it. Uh, yeah, everyone can make an intelligence check uh, at advantage. Yeah, at, or if you have Arcana. Player, yeah, if you have Arcana. Yeah, or if you have the, Arcana. And the player cannot remember that. <laughs> Actually, as you do that, uh, Sadimus is going to do it too. Why not? See if he uh, recognizes uh, your cloak. advantage. I'm not that, so I'm not, I'm not going to bother. Oh, I'm not down. Down. <laughs> 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 not a clue. We should be out of the range, I'm pretty sure, okay. right? You guys, you guys are okay. With a 26, uh, tell Sadimos with a clock. That's <laughs> 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 he's not, but that's the point. No, he's, he's shouting the coat and not what you need to do in, in case of the coat. <laughs> no, I'm, but it's true. He made an arcana check. Oh, he right. got a 19, so plus 7, so yeah, 26. Yeah, but he knows the what, name of the coat, but he doesn't know what it does. I mean, he's just looking at the coat, so he will, with that, he will know if it's a magical thing. He will know yeah. if it's a normal magical item. Just tell me what it is to remind me. As this animals. is the robe of scintillating colors. Okay. So, so that's what, what I mean. Uh, so what Aki's going to do, Aki's going to flap the coat, presumably with a little leech attached to it at this point, and spend one of the charges to, shend, uh, to send a shifting pattern of dazzling hues uh, around himself until the end of his next turn. 30 feet of bright light goes out, an additional 30 feet of dim light, but any creature within the, thir the first 30 feet needs to make a DC 15 wisdom save. Okay, so whoever failed the, the, the intelligence check... Uh, what was the DC for the intelligence check? Uh, the DC will be 10. Well, let's, be, let's be nice. You know? So you have advantage passed. and the DC is 10. Yeah. So then you will remember You will remember yeah. perfectly what it is. We, we, we have the wisdom save. Yeah. Anyway. Yeah. 
So I don't know if you need to uh, roll for all of the wee beasties. Uh, Herald and Ruin are fine. You're out of range. I'll check. Uh, I'm, I'm I'm adding that d12. Good call. It. It's 15. You're fine. The 15. The DC was 15. Mm. They, yeah, do, fine. they don't. They uh, they're. They don't have eyes. Any creature within the bright light that can see you. Yeah, fair enough. Um, when it's activated, it doesn't last. It's later. Ooh, just Bruce makes it. Yogu I makes it. I thought we were it. rolling to see what it would do to avoid the wisdom save. All right, let's go. I mean, the yeah. effects are they, they, they it's just you know. Like you say, they have blind sight only, so they wouldn't be affected by it. whatever it is. Uh, and... Uh, I need Zadimus to make the, uh, assuming Zadimus has to, uh, make a uh, roll for something you can see. Yeah, let me have a look to make sure as well if he's got something. What is the effect that he does actually? Uh, if he Stunned. Stunned, Stunned. Stunned, okay. Pretty rough. Yeah, that's pretty rough. Okay, so yeah, he will uh, do it. Yeah. It's a magical effect. So. Oh, oh, yes, silvery Oh. <gasps> I was hoping you would say that. Okay. <laughs> I don't want you to do something a bit bigger, but yeah, I'll so he will keep. Not. He will keep twelve. That is his uh, higher roll, and then re-roll one die. It was twelve on the die, uh, and he roll a ten on the second one. So he will pick the ten instead of the twelve. And which save was it again? Uh, wisdom. Wisdom. Okay, he's got a plus ten on wisdom because he's oh. actually a cleric. Uh, not a wizard, as you all think. So yeah, that will be a 20 on the save. Shit. Okay, he passes. Never mind. Sorry, uh, but creatures that can okay. see me have disadvantage on attacking me now. So at least um, that's happening. Uh, okay. Yadu yeah. has has the um adva uh, the advantage. Actually, as well. actually, that's a point. Uh, my apologies. He only has true sight uh, as well. Oh, oh, so he wouldn't have had to make the save. Yeah, he wouldn't have had to make the save. This Sorry. is an I absolutely ridiculous senses, monster. Senses to the five. <laughs> I mean, I haven't changed anything. Can I have that's the original. It is. it is how it is. So, can which one? Uh, yeah, yeah, you can have your spell. Great. Spell back. Yeah, because that will have happened. You know, you will have known that uh, he I, seems unfazed, you know? I thought, yeah. no, I thought True Sight still gets affected by the blindness. Yeah. Because he still well, has no, it, it, Let me check. Well, I'll check it. I'll check it anyway. But uh, yeah, I can't. Bl I can't blind him. But I could. Yeah. Stun. To to him, I think to, to with true sight, the the effect will then actually he will see things how they are because this is an illusion. So I think he will be affected. It. Okay. Uh, <laughs> has lost. Uh, that was lost. But two blindness. True sight. No, just. See, he threw magical dart invisibility illusion. Let's make a fair roll. How is that? Oh, well, already I'll, passed I'll make it. He's already passed it. There's another point, but I think True Sight, I'm just checking. Yeah, True Sight um, still affects, uh, you can still get blinded by it because it just enhances um, your vision to see like illusions and invisibility yeah. and ethereal. So technically, you're still looking unless you have blind sight. Mm. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah, that's a different yeah, one. That's yeah. a different one. Okay, yeah, that's that's a good point. Okay, so then the monsters should have to make the save too, right? Because they no. have, or, or they have blind sight. They have blind sight. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, Wait, so yeah, so they have blind me, sight. Yeah. Did the save happen for him to not be affected? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Right. yeah. So then you okay. let's you, say that you use the spell, he uses yeah. the lowest, and okay. then all that happened. Uh, my yeah. apologies, uh, guys. Yeah, Yard, Yardu still has the advantage though. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. yeah. Never mind. That was my that was my, my best attempt. Uh, and from here, that's uh, I'll, I'll say that's the movement uh, so far. Uh, yeah, I'm going to end my turn there. That's all I had. Good job. All right. Cool. Cool. Uh, after your turn, uh, we move to. Hmm. One second. Let me just think this quickly. Yeah, why not? He will see you, Aki, up there. Uh, and then he will look at Sigi and Yagu so close. The more you fall, the less things you can do. And once more, you will see the two of you, uh, Yagu and Sigi. You will see that uh, writhing silvery mist uh, rises from below you. I need you to make a dexterity saving throw. Uh, what's the minimum damage you'll do with that spell? 
11 if you succeed. Then, um, if I succeed, shit. Yeah. I have 7 hit points, so whether I succeed or not, I don't. I, don't I will roll, roll it just it. to make it first, so uh, it could be left. Uh, dexterity saving throw. I will use my uh, oh, nice. D20. Okay. Yep. Um, yeah, just the silver barbs, so your next check is an advantage anyway. Yeah, I'm check. check. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Cool. Amazing. Uh, cool, cool. So, yeah, you both are successful. Let me just roll it, actually. Actually, let's make it more fun. Why don't you roll it, uh, Luke, actually? So, please Why, roll. Because it's the yeah. last roll I make this session. Great, oh, no. Yeah. <laughs> Damn, no, it's not true. I mean, literally, so please if roll, I roll 4d10, please. 4d10. Yeah. And okay. that would be half of whatever. Okay. Oh, my God. Okay, here's the thing. If I roll 4, as in the number, I'm fine. If I roll you can do it. Higher, they believe in you. Yeah. Do it. Yeah, no, I can't. No, oh, I can't. Literally, okay. one of the dice is a seven. Guess how many hit points I have. You roll fucking high in there. Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, Ziggy's down again. Sorry. Yeah, good out. job. Yeah. You killed Shogu as well. Hey, this is yeah. my fucking fault, Mark. I still yeah. blame you. You, you have the chance it's to It's my birthday. Soul. You have oh, a chance no. to kill soul tomorrow, okay? Yeah. I mean, you should be raging, right? Uh, 13 points of damage, Mark. And, um, oh yeah, it's only ever mind. Yeah, you're I've got into health of the half. Yeah, yeah. yeah. never mind. Yeah, because yeah. yeah, you're half of the half. Yeah. Yeah, please remember, okay. there's a potion sitting there because no one uses it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna grab hey, it. I'm right. not. It's that's not. I have not <laughs> my turn. this entire time. Yeah. Yep. Okay. And that will finish this uh, Sadimos legendary action. Yagu, you're next. Oh, sorry, we both did it. Uh, okay, no worries. I'll yeah, no. I'll do the skipping more. Applying oh. a potion was an action, right? Uh yes. To, for you to give it to someone yeah. else is an action. For you to drink it yourself is a bonus action. I think the staff might be a better idea, depending how many charges you have left on it. If I'm being yeah, honest. I only have enough charges to do one AOE heal and then it's over. So. Up to you. Uh, this sucks. I won't think about it too hard because I can get Errol and myself plenty of love. Yeah, but we want Errol to have a turn, so if we do Air of Effect heal, we can bring two guys heal. back up. Yeah, heal. but I want. We only have one AOE heal, so I want to keep it as mm -hmm. long as possible for as much value yeah. possible, but. If I want to heal Ziki now, I have to drop no, my rage. No, don't waste it. Don't waste it. So I should uh, do my turtle things. Yeah, come on. Uh, yeah, then I will. Sixty uh, seconds. <laughs> recklessly attack right creature here. Okay. With uh, infernal oh. serpent blades. Come on, be good enough. Eh. Ten points of damage to the right one. Dead hits and ten points. Yeah, still alive though. Plus, plus your age, so twelve, right? Oh yeah, twelve. Yeah, plus two. Yeah. Mm -hmm. still, still alive. Um, then I'm attacking the one that's at, uh, on top of Ziggy mm -hmm. first. Did you ignite him? Or... He's only fourteen to it. Fourteen actually misses. <laughs> And yeah, then bonus action, attack the one at the right of me again. Alright. Ah, oh, come on. Better 16? 16 hits. And with that, you see this one just just get sliced and fall onto the ground and stop moving. It is dead. Great, besides that, I can't do anything, so I will end my turn there. Alright. All right, yeah. So as you uh, end your turn, uh, the right there next to you, Bruce, is your go. What would you like to do? Um, would you allow me to disengage, pick up the potion, throw it down Ziggy's neck, and then run to here to then free this bubble? Disengage will be an action. So Yeah, I'm hasted though, so I'm asking if I can do these okay, things. Okay, so yeah, you can you disengage as your extra action, right? Or is it only dash, actually? It's uh, It should be disengaged as the extra action for a haste. Short, I think it's short, dash. A, short a answer, no, because you're going to disengage as an action and then an action to administer feed. feed. Yeah. So you won't be able to do yeah. the last attack. Bit. So it's no, no, it's no, no will you allow me? It's more like a can I do it kind of no, thing. No, <laughs> Otherwise, it feels bad. Economy. I'm sorry. Yeah. We well, will focus love on the scissors. I would say disengage oh, yeah. in scissors. Focus right, on well, the scissors. The actual mission. 
I'm gonna pick up the potion though. I'm gonna do that. Yeah, that's your interaction, so that's not an issue. You can do that either way. Just make sure I make a note that I have it. Uh, yeah, yeah, you can. You can disengage with that action. Your action, yeah, your extra action can be disengaged. So yeah, yeah right. that's fine. So I you disengage. have two main actions. I stab the citizen, the sigil. Well, as you enter in there, I need you to make an Arcana check first. To, yeah. to locate the sigil itself but as you do enter into that one immediately you feel this kind of dark aura of necrotic energy especially it's very familiar to what Zanimus is doing but it's just all around you and it's just this dark space and as you do and you enter an arcana check of 19 easily exactly wow. where you walk to is where the sigil is <laughs> exactly the where the where we put right. where the circle is and as you see it immediately whoosh, sink the scissors in twist it and the sigil just <laughs> breaks and what you see as you enter as well is that ruin is there but hiding in the corner as well is a very feathered folk uh owlin who is kind of uh sitting there in the corner all curled up um and looks up towards you ruin's spirit doesn't uh necessarily move and stuff but the, the but the owlin uh, rubus actually looks up to you and recognizes you and kind of reaches out his wing um in ac acknowledgement that you are you are there and as this sigil happens you see something else you see zadimus again screech in pain and thing and you begin to see him sink towards the ground as he is unable to fly no longer Right, um, that was 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. Just, to, just a quick thing. Uh, we are in round 6 now, right? This is end of... We're still on round 5. five We're like on the tip end, end of 5. Having... I've been keeping so having we done then two rounds, actually? This is round 2 in this session. So then it's round 6, right? Round 5, because yeah. we were in midway round 4. Uh, round four. Oh, yeah, yeah, of course, we were midway round 4. Yeah, that's it, that's it. Yeah, cool, cool. Yeah. I've only right, had right, one right, action. <laughs> yep. I uh, remember we, we can't we can't be heard in here, so even if I shout something... No, now, one, now, now, this, now it disappears, it dissipates. Yeah, it's oh. just, yeah. Right, so, okay. Um, he'll bellow if... Uh, <clears throat> if anyone can help us, now be a good time. Um, with my remaining... Movement, so whatever, one, five, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty-five, twenty-five, thirty, thirty-five. Uh, can I still attack? Because I'm, I'm trying to make sure that's what I can definitely do. I've, I've, uh, I've done, I've freed them. I've disengaged. I've got that third thing to do. Is that it's not an so action? You, I can't... So you use, you use two actions and two interactions now. So I think a second that's... interaction. Yeah, to find the sigil because we are uh, that was part of the mechanic of the sigil. So you took an interaction to grab the potion, an interaction to find the sigil, and then an action to cut the scissors and an action to disengage. So I think that's so, unless no. you have a third extra something for other right. Reasons. No, never mind. Bo no, bonus never action. Mind. No, yeah, bonus you mind. have a mm -hmm. bonus just, action. You have just to. drink at this point. Right, I may as well. Um, you need to keep that rage up. Yeah. No, I need to not die. <laughs> yeah, that's a good point. Because now you see that Sadimos is really like focused on you as you cut another of these things and pieces of flesh fall off him more again as well as he descended into the ground. Right, um, that's it. So 35, 35, 40, 45, 50. Um, can I see the sigil? Uh, you will have to wait until your next time because you need to use an interaction to look for the sigil right we i'll stand it, there so, yeah. um mm -hmm. so yeah bruiser shouted if anyone can help now's the chance and uh, at the end of my turn he's going to uh what can he clasp he's going to clasp the bear claw because that he has on his pendant and he's going to mutter a quick prayer to himself and he's like soon if you can hear me in this godforsaken realm now's the time to do something special Make a religion check. Done. Make a religion check. Uh, da, 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 da. Where are you, religion? I've lost religion. Oh no! <laughs> Never mind. 
you if you have any any uh, inspiration you could use it or any anything extra to add to it because this potentially could be good for you up to you sure since you might want to recommending it <laughs> uh, i'm gonna give it a go Noise. Oh, that's a waste. Never mind. Sorry, boys. <laughs> Told you, religion's a sham. It's a little crap. <laughs> Damn it. Sorry, guys. Yep. All right. You feel that uh, somehow Saloon is too far in this realm. And even though normally seeing the moon itself that is called Saloon as the goddess, you don't see anything here and it doesn't make you feel good. I, I don't feel good. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I don't feel good. The numbers are, I'm crunching in my head are all bad. We can... <laughs> Damn it. No. Cool, cool. Uh, and you finish your turn there, Bruce, I assume? I can't do anything else. All right. I've called for help from the people who are trapped and uh, the goddess who supposedly chose me, and she's not picking up the phone. I, will add, I, will, I just want to add something. As you enter into the space of that one, you, s you hear the sound of lightning and thunder all around as multiple portals kind of appear and lightning kind of whizzes and passes and you have to kind of move around. And as you kind of duck, you look immediately below you and there you see Aki's mum right there, Vergwin. And she looks up to you and yeah, that's the end of your turn. Okay. Enough. Of your fucking scissoring, and you will see Sadimos hand uh, <laughs> point towards you. I'm sorry for the wording; that sounded completely wrong. But yeah, it's not what he means. Uh, <laughs> like he didn't intend it. I love it. Yep, uh, I might have not intended it. <laughs> you will never know. Sure. And he will go ahead and uh, blast you once more. Uh, actually, you know what? Let's let's go crazy. He's really angry with you. So he will use two legendary actions, even though you are very low on health, to make sure you go down. And you will see that a, a bolt of lightning erupts from his hand. <laughs> and once he hits you, uh, there is no one in range else that he can hit. But he will be happy just to hit you with it. So I need you to make a dexterity saving throw, I believe. Let me just double check. And see, use lightning bolt on you, using two legendary actions. <laughs> You might be able to survive this. Yeah, you could be actually. Lightning Freeze. bolt. So yeah, there's hundred foot line, stroke of lightning. Blah, nothing blah, left blah. but a scorch mark. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Dexterity save. Yeah. Uh, You're raging, right? Yes. Yeah, and I'll roll it on the opens just to make it more fun. <sighs> if it nothing it helps. Yeah, you I do. don't have anything left at all. Did, did Are you, you sure? Did, did, you, did you use that D12? I rolled yes. really fucking low. You your, your prayer to saloon worked. Yeah. Oh. Harold, I don't have that kind of movement I put speed. it on the open. I have one D12. What the hell? Wow. Wait, no. no. Wait a second. Wait a second. 12 and 6. 18. Nine, nine, nine. 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 9 damage. Well, no. fuck me. Saloon did listen. Yeah, you see? <laughs> she was there. Even Hold though on. You didn't Hold on. Her. God has granted me life today, and I'm about to make it your problem. <laughs> oh God, that was the worst roll of 86 ever. It's like way below average. Okay, cool. So Sadimos looks at you like. Oh. You heard me. <laughs> I'll never you see, as, as he looks at you and kind of like uh, his jaw kind of like unhinges, and you see like a piece of his jaw is kind of like dangling now as he's like more and more damaged, like in rage, like. <laughs> What the fuck? How did he do that? How did he keep standing from that? It's like... Oh, it's a Dragon Ball Z cartoon now. So... <laughs> Shut all. You go. All right. And the camera moves to you. I to Mason. Very nice one. Let's go. As you do another, let's say. Can you see it, uh, DMs? I did on D&D Beyond, but it didn't show up. Uh, it, sometimes it takes a second to pop up. Uh, OK. I didn't click the public button, that's why I didn't want it doing a repeat of what happened last time. Yeah. I'll have to go into the game one second and let me double check. Yeah, I, I, can, I can do it too. I can DM it to you guys, hold on. Um, no. And it's in the D&D Beyond thing. Uh, it says 2DM. Okay. Uh, let me just go on it as well more. Maybe yeah. I might 
that might help. On sick. All right. Uh, in the meantime, actually, why don't we go to the next turn? Yeah, while go, we check go that, for it. And yeah. then uh, we'll we'll yeah. go back to it. All right. So after that, will be yeah. Zadi must use two legendary actions, so he doesn't have any more. So it's your turn, Ruin. All right. Uh, after being like warped to the floor, I'm gonna. Uh, I really hate fucking teleporting. I'll uh, look at the ground, uh, uh, Errol, and I'll look at everyone else and be like, <sighs> might as well. And then I'm gonna uh, tap Errol on the shoulder and I will put a okay. twin spell, cure wounds. I'm gonna cure wounds him and then cure wounds myself. Okay, nice. So I think that's. Is that two sorcerer points to do that at second level? If uh, he's. Uh, oh, yeah. you're doing a second level yet, too. Okay. How, whatever the level is, is the cost. Okay. Then yeah, Errol gets so the first silly, die, actually, so one. this is for Errol. Mm -hmm. Ooh, it was almost good. It was almost two eights. Hey, that's fine. Oh, I'll wow, take nice. it. So it's an then, 11? Okay. Yeah, and this is for myself. <laughs> there we go. 15. And then I will bonus action. I'm going to put Shield of Faith on Herald and drop the hex off of. You can't do Shield of Faith because that's an additional spell. You did cure wounds already. Fuck, you're yeah, right. Man. Fuck, God. Fuck, Sorry, fuck, 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 fuck. Honestly, lucky, just how, long, how long has it been? <laughs> uh, uh, lucky. I know. I always forget. Right. At this point, so get the ground. What I'm going to do at this it. point, I'll. I don't want to get opportunity. Can it? No. Uh, you it can't. To me. It's clung to me. It can't attack you. I don't want it to cling off of you and onto me. It's not going to move. It's, it likes its food. It's fine. It's ordering fine elven cuisine. Then I will can you, fly. Can you, I'm going to fly an additional five feet up in the air. Okay. So I'm going to be 10 feet up in the air. All right. Okay. Perfect. Hopefully out of the reach of everything on the ground. Okay. As you fly up, it detaches itself and tries oh, to... Oh, look at that! I can't <laughs> <touch> it! <laughs> no, it can't. Cuisine. It can't, it can't do it. It's I fine. It oh, can't okay, do I was going to say, I saw Mo's eyebrows. <laughs> I literally watched Mo's eyebrows. He goes... I would elf the vegetarian option. What's that? I want to go... I would elf the vegetarian option. Yep. Yep. Yeah. All that green. Barky. Ten feet up in the air. So that's... Uh, that'll be five... Or no, yeah, that'll be 10, 15, 20, 25. I don't want him to see me 30. Hiding, <laughs> hiding away from Zadimus. Okay. Valid. Cool, cool. Very nice. Uh, yeah. yeah, I see yeah. I see me and I'm going to go to me. Cool. And uh, that, I guess that will finish your turn, right? Yep, Anything I've got nothing else. else. All right. Errol, you can take the cross off if you're up now, uh, please. I've only put the oh, yeah, he, I've oh, only he's, put the... oh, he's on the oh, no. <laughs> with the camera with the phone. Yeah, he's on a call or something. Sorry for that. Okay, sure, cool, sure. cool. Uh, so let's do now. We are in round six, uh, beginning of the round. Yeah, I'll change the Amazing. number. Yeah, oh, perfect. Thank you. Great. Uh, that's so clever, actually. But it's gonna get to a point. Oh, yeah, we don't. Yeah, yeah, okay, okay, okay. Very nice. Cool. Uh, Siggy, oh, what would I've, you like I've, to do? I've rolled the save. You can just like, oh, yes. The... Okay, that's mm -hmm. the... Yeah, this one is uh, actually up here there. So, yeah, okay. Uh, Sigi. Uh, as you are actually, let's before the roll actually and everything comes through. As you are there between life and death, Sigi, once more, you feel like you are not fully alone. There is someone else in there. Sigi. You hear a familiar voice uh, of the whatever creature. Uh, resides alongside you at the moment. Remember, I'm here for you, Ziggy. I can help you if you want. I'm not listening to another fucking voice. I've already failed enough in this life. I mean, the dead don't help. The dead are just dead. Yep, the dead don't do anything for me. I, I am a lot of things, but my word counts. I am... Are, are you dead? 
I am you neither dead. dead nor alive. Uh, it, it's a, I, I want. I'm not one of the peasants I work with. Okay, I want a full answer. I am undead. Are you dead? I am undead. Then you're not fucking useful. If you just said yourself. I mean, I'm gonna die here of failure, and that's about it. I am a very powerful undead, and I'm yes, not a god or an dead. evil. You just said the dead are useful, uh, useless. So. Well, if you wanna die, I'm happy with that. I'm just trying to help you. There's nothing anyone can do to help me. Well, if you just let me try and consent to it, maybe just I will be dead, able to help the dead you. Dead and useless, <laughs> and you're dead. Up to you, Ziggy. All right, and we move to Sadimon's turn. Uh... Mm. Could I play dead? <laughs> 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 oh, he got me! Uh... <clears throat> oh, the mystery! Oh, I'm hiding behind a nice obsidian obelisk. Okay, everyone is moved out of the way. As uh, Sadimus looks around, he sees like a, out of the sudden, he just looks at you, Bruce, holding the scissors. And Aki okay. there on the top. And he will have to do what he has to do. Uh, he will gonna try to recharge his tentacle attack. I'm sorry, that's a six. <laughs> Have you? This is a recharge attack. You've successfully recharged the tentacle he, all six he need, turns. He no, needs no, to no. roll either a one or a two to not recharge it. So I'm just trying to because the monster itself normally always has it, but I thought it was a bit much. So I, we gave it a recharge uh, concept, but it's very limit. It's very likely that he will recharge every time, you know. But yeah, uh, yeah he will move towards nice. you. Uh, and his main tentacle once more will put throat out of his chest, uh, oh. attempting to hit you. Not one, not one, not one, not one, not one. It could happen, actually. He hits himself in the face. Ooh, okay, Wait, that was let Mo no roll. Let Mo roll. Let Mo roll. <laughs> yeah. No, that's an 11 on the die, plus his modifying is 11. Yeah, so 22 to hit. A plus 11? I think yeah, it goes so, I mean, you guys way. have to almost. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Uh, oh, plus as, could still come as he hits you, Bruce, uh, he will do 20 points of damage already halved. I'm down. Um, I don't know how you let me flub this, though. Bruce goes down. Roulette's endurance will kick in. Can I play dead? Actually, no, because you'll pick up the scissors. It doesn't matter. You hit me, I go down. And he just coughs up more blood, but he's still standing. Okay. Uh, he's... Mm. That relentless endurance. Well, you still need yeah, to make a... Attack, so. Yeah, you still need to make a save, by the way. A wisdom save. Yeah, um, wisdom wisdom. save. Mm. Advantage. 21. Fuck it! <laughs> oh, nice. Okay, yeah. Once more, you feel exhaustion like washes over you, but uh, you are too strong for that. Too angry um, to die. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and um, you are not dying. You will oh. now. And uh, you see, you feel like his mind, like the force of his mind, is kind of like hitting you, like almost with a wave. He mm -hmm. did roll a four, actually. You are prone, though. No, he's not. He doesn't go. I, no, he doesn't go prone. down. He doesn't go down. He's just you still up. Yeah, yeah, okay, you don't. Okay, you don't fall. Yeah, okay, yeah. So then, uh, that will be a fifteen to hit. Actually, he roll a four. <laughs> wow. Wow. Everyone rolls bad sometimes. Sometimes this goes on. Nice four there. Yeah. Well. Let me just go back to what I said before. God, the goddess has granted me life today, and I'm about to make it his problem. Yeah. <laughs> Damn. Okay, so as you like somehow. You think of Selum that is in your mind still, and you feel that this force, psychic force that is trying to invade your mind, just is pushed away. Yeah, as he yanks out the tentacle from his from his like his chest again, just <sighs> you can't even speak at this point. <laughs> Damn you! Damn you! And then you'll see the hand kind of flies 
In oh, he's direction. so relentless. He wants to hit you, so he wants yeah. to kill you so bad. Can I get one oh. last, one last dig at him? Only damn thing he is you. <laughs> <sighs> yes, I did. It's an you know, right? I don't think you can hit it with an AO. I did. Uh, yep, and he will try to hit you with the same with the force thingy. I can't remember how it's called now. The clenching, not the Go clench. Fist. He's trying to hit you. Yeah. Yeah. So oh, that would be. What was okay, everyone saying earlier about OAs or AOs? What? Attack opportunity. I can't hit it right because it will just move on down and then to the right. I assume. But yeah. He, so... he was next to you. He was large. I saw him. But it was. You can take an opportunity attack if you want. It doesn't matter. It's no yeah. big deal. <laughs> it doesn't matter. Yeah, that, no, I mean he's he, he he's got enough movement to actually move up and then. Oh, you know, okay, the, yeah, yeah. The yeah, hand yeah. is not as stupid because he's uh, Salimos, even though the hand probably is stupid. So that <laughs> might actually <laughs> miss too. Uh, okay, Please. so that I roll a nine, and on the clench fist he use a melee, right? It says here, make a melee. Yeah, uh, yeah your modifier has been absurd for this. What's thing. your so AC? Probably gonna eighteen. Uh, so it's 9 plus 8, right? So that's 17. Yeah, that's that's easy. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Well, the loon is with you after all. He's swingy, I wow. duck. Yep. He's, he, Bruce just slips onto the blood he's, that's pouring off of him like a fountain. That's why he ducks under it. <laughs> you know, like I imagine Sadimos going like, oh, and he just hits the hand like if it was a normal creature, like a slap on the face. But there is no face, it's just a hand. It just like so, looks I'm to you. I'm surrounded by idiots, damn it! <laughs> yep, and that will finish his turn, actually. Yep, that's it. Damn, you very see, nice. You see, oh. at the end of his turn, from his anger... Ooh, he heals, actually. Yeah, he, he, you see him kind of get angry. And from the remaining four, you see him funneling the energy from that and when you look down you see uh you see aki's mother kind of fall to the ground very very weak frail um and probably the others in the other four remaining ones are also feeling the same effect yes the end is near <laughs> hey guys help <laughs> <laughs> I didn't take damage this round. Yeah. Yes. Uh, roll this <laughs> uh, Not ruin. Uh, not not anymore for ruin, right? Because they. It's a bruise now. They, they, oh yeah, yeah. Ruin, ruin is free actually. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Thanks to bruise. Yeah, yeah. No anymore. Ruin is ruin. free. Free, free. <laughs> but it's Ricky. Roll a d6. Who? All right. Can't you be any clear action. Yep. Oh yeah. Can't be any worse than uh, what's going on. A one. A one. One. Well, nothing happened on one, right? Oh well, well let's find out. We all healed to full HP, if I remember. Yeah, I think so. <laughs> yeah, uh, definitely. Oh no. Oh, okay, okay. Uh, just give me hmm. the damage, oh, please. Okay. Hmm. Just... <sighs> Who do I want to pick? I guess. Bring it on. I'm gonna focus on. on the most two dangerous people right now. That is going to be Aki. And Ruse. Oh come on! Uh, Stop. He uses on, his legendary so action. He focuses. So he's so angry with you. He focuses um, he, uh, his uh, energy, and as they do, you see him affecting your mind. I need you both to make me a. What save is it? It doesn't say. Uh, one second. Uh, is clear. this a avoid damage completely or half damage roll? Because it doesn't matter either oh, way. No, it's, it's, not. it's got nothing oh, yeah. to do, that, do with that. Mm. Oh, yeah, let, let's go into the oh, spell. I think uh, it's wisdom, actually. Yeah. Well, let me just I think check. we did this one before. Yeah, I'm checking now. Mm. I think it was wisdom. <laughs> let me double check. It is. If it's some, hmm, if it's some kind of mind altering wisdom. spell, wisdom I've already succeed, if we've already yeah. succeeded on the save, are we now immune to it or something? Uh, if you succeed this effect, and no, nope, it's nope. just a spell. It's just a, it's just a, an effect of a spell. I'm clutching its throw. I'm clutching yep, its both throw. Both of you give me wisdom saving throws. Aki and Bruce. Can, oh. can I give my d12 to Bruce? No. I'm begging. I'm spent. I am spending my inspiration to do this at advantage. You already have advantage. No, no, no the, I don't. The fact that Aki's oh, you don't. Yeah. Oh shit. Bruce, uh, twenty-one. Pretty good. But is it enough? I'm I'm about ninety percent sure it is. <laughs> but there's ten percent though. Eighteen is that enough? Wow. That was him. 
eighty percent sure. I'm, I'm stuck in my one D twelve on top. <laughs> uh, I think it's nineteen to DC. All right, just draw your D twelve. Just do it. All right, there you go. Twenty two. Because yeah, he has a plus ten, plus eleven to his uh, modifier for all this. Yeah, then the DC. Yeah, if it's only eighteen, <laughs> it sounds low. Uh, yeah, you both save. Nothing happens. You break away yes! from 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 this effect. <laughs> that their action is. Uh, that was the last action, right? Uh, it's complete. Lair, lair, lair. lair action. That was a lair action. However, at the end of the its turn, oh, the little puppet parasites are gonna have their chow down on people. Uh, oh, uh, Ziggy. Uh, Ziggy. Hmm. Du, 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 du. Well, it's actually this one actually is gonna move uh, on to. There's gonna be two of them coming towards you, Mister uh, Yagu. Well, this one is going to move towards Aki, two of them. One's already attached to you, Aki. Um, yeah. And then this one is going to attack Herald, which is attached to you as well. So I'll do the ones with Yagu first. Uh, as, okay. they, as they try to sling, uh, uh, cling to you, Yagu, first attack. A 10, that's a miss. Second one, a 17. I wish that I could hits. Have that hits. I really okay, wish. then you take sorry. nine points of necrotic damage. No, don't apologize. You got me up. Oof, oof, oof. Don't say sorry. You're fine. You're still up, right? Uh, Aki. Still up. Better. Yes. One of them uh, again tries to cling onto you first. That's yep. a six. But the other one is now going to consume life. Uh, as it is attached to you already, mm. you take. Eight points of necrotic damage. Uh, it doesn't need to roll uh, as it consumes your life. Uh, uh, and it regains hit points, but he hasn't taken any damage anyway. So that's fine. And then no, the okay. one on you, Mr. Errold, as it is still attached, will also consume life. And you take ten points of uh, necrotic damage. Oh, just, just hanging in there. I'm so glad I got that at, at second level. I, I'm still up, but oh, 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 oh no. All right, um, that will finish that. And then we, the camera moves towards you, Aki, as you are there still uh, on the northeast on the map, but this time with two creatures, or three creatures almost, all of them are pretty close to you. What would you like to do? Make me a off. From where I am, I've got, to, I've got to give this a shot. I'm going to try and cast Polymorph on uh, Zadimus. Okay. For which I require a save, please. All right. Uh, so please tell me which save you require. Mm. And what's the range on Polymorph, shit. actually? Mm. Shit, 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 please. shit. Please. 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 50. It is exactly what I'm standing Oh, nice. <laughs> okay. All right. Um, for the love that is on Eldath. So, like, uh, unfortunately oh. for you, I haven't rolled yet, but you know he's a cleric. Uh, so Yeah, but I don't got advantage. much else. Okay, all right. Okay, just okay, roll okay. five or something. Yeah, oh, I fuck. Roll actually, that. would you Actually, before I do that, would you allow me to do something else before I do that? Because you haven't rolled yet. Is that permissible? Uh, yeah, I mean, you want to change your mind or because... Yeah, of... yeah, I think I'm going to yeah, change sure. what I'm going to try sure, and do sure. here. No problem. If I think there's 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, if I was to cast the fireball there, I would catch the hand and Zadimus and this little bastard in it all at the same time. Yeah, it would be very good for me. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's correct. You're not going to hit then, Bruce with that? No, no, it's only 20 feet. Mm -hmm. He's 20, 20 feet. feet radius. Yeah. Because he's on the yeah, you you don't you can cast it without hitting Bruce easily. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. So I'm going to I'm going to uh, level this. So I'll make up a fourth level. My my last fourth level spell slot, fireball, and everybody needs to make a dex save. Still eating. Okay. Uh, I'll yeah. roll again uh, yeah. just to make it more fair. Because uh. it was a high roll. <laughs> I'm covered by the elbows, right? So dex set is saving through. Oh, okay. Uh, you're also in the air, so you're not exactly. He's on the ground. He's on the ground. No, no, I mean, the, he's not flying anymore. Ruin. He, he Ruin is in the air. Oh, okay. Yeah, but Will I'm Roy have to do it? No, he's I'm behind the monolith. Yeah. You're behind the monolith. Uh, just make it anyway, and you will take less damage if you fail. 
Because he says that the fire spreads around corners, doesn't he? On the spell, on the fireball. Does it? Uh, I'll tell you what, I'll just play it. Yes, it does. The yeah. next flammable also, object. Yeah. I'm also 10 feet up in the air. Um, yeah, but it's a ball. It's yeah, not it's a, a ball. plate. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So make it, you will take a half of the damage. I mean, half of half, whatever you roll. You know what I mean? Like, it, you will. So the the, the, the obelisk will though. take half. Yeah. Okay, if you, if you put it there, actually. Uh... Say, I'm, I'm hiding behind them. a solid. Yeah, actually, you are not actually on on the area. Yeah, yeah that's fine. I don't so think I get about it. Oh, it does know. spread around yeah, corners. Far. Yeah, but it doesn't yeah, reach you anyway. So yeah, don't worry it about doesn't. It. It, it will uh, if you were hidden, but you were in the area, but you actually not so out of. In uh, the how area. are we? Yeah. How are we for everyone's deck saves? All right. So, hmm. I guess he didn't counter spell it, so it's too late for that. Uh, Sadimos will do use his last legendary resistance to succeed because he actually fell with a six. So okay, so he takes half. Yeah, he's mine. So he... yeah. Oh wow, and a three. What is that? Yeah, he uh, failed anyway. <laughs> At advantage, but yeah. he's got plus nine. So but yeah, still not enough. So that will be yeah, it's not enough. Fifteen. Fifteen is a fail, right? Uh, Yes, and yeah. that's not a great roll. 27 fire damage is not good for this level, but... Uh, so he will take half, because he's... So 13, because it's 13 13. plus 14, so yeah, 13. 13, yeah. yeah. Okay. 3, 1's and a 2. <laughs> I know. We've been cursed with some really... So you, I mean, everybody's so rolled bad. damage more, yeah? And I'll mark off his legendary thingy. Cool, cool. For my bonus action, um, the one that is the little leech that is attached to me, uh -huh. I'd like to quicken a green flame blade. Uh, so I'd like to just use, uh, a, if you'd allow my interaction, to uh, pull a dagger out of my belt and just try and flick it off, or as much okay. as I can, kind of jab, jab it off. All right. So yeah. you do the damage for the fireball mode. Yeah, yeah, I'm adjusting it now. Okay, cool, cool. Thir half, yeah, so 30. Or whatever, yeah. So, and uh, the green flame oh. blade, yeah, you yep. take the dagger out, no problem. Yeah, go ahead. I'll try and get the blade in underneath this thing. Oh, 13 to hit. <laughs> can I miss it if it's attached to me? Uh, <laughs> you can! Yeah, I think you kind of still miss it, yeah? It still moves a little bit. Do you have your D12? Can you still use that? I have used that. Okay, never mind. And yeah, 13, unfortunately, the creature kind of like, it's kind of jelly-like. It's got the same kind of texture as Sadimo's skin uh, at the moment. Well, whatever is left of it. But yeah. mm -hmm. This is going very poorly. Uh, then, yeah, I, I, I'll, I'll stay where I am again um, from here, but at least we've burnt the legendary resistance, I guess. That's the end of my turn. That's very good. Okay, fantastic. Uh, so after that, we move to Yagu's turn. Oh, that's their reaction. Whoa, yes, and finally. I'll keep okay. that one one second. I'll just move that um, one out. I have reasons for this, so for, sorry in advance for this, Ross, but I want Telekinetic Blast the tentacle towards Aki. I have my reasons, believe me. <laughs> so it has to make a strength saving throw, 14. Strength save coming up. That is a 7. Oh. Oh, yes, it gets pushed away from me. Five okay. feet. Nice. Oh, now I can move safely over here. I have only three HP because that's why I'm. Because now <laughs> I am in range, so I can target Bruce, well, everyone except for Airwald. That's fine. And I'm gonna swing my step around and I'm gonna cast my holy spell, Mass Cure Wounds, on the everyone. Oh. Oh. Except Airwald. Let's Please go. Oh, well. oh, that's a good roll. That's a good roll. 20 HP to everyone roll. except for yeah. Airwolds. Oh, That's wow, fine. Nice. <laughs> I, I don't need something if you could give it to Airwolves. No, no, don't, don't worry about me. Just everyone needs to get up. I can make more I'm death saves, guys. The <laughs> you can't, you can't reach Airwolves anyway, it doesn't matter. I can't it doesn't reach Airwolves. So. It's oh, not okay, HP. Okay. So, yeah, that's 20 for everyone. Oh. God, I feel great. Right, well, if you feel great, you've got to distract this bugger. <laughs> Do something, help save me. Ah! 
Can someone grab my bow? I think it's a good point. How much okay. movement do you have left? Grab it and chuck it. No, no, I'm, I'm, Take I'm, the bow away from a razor. What do you have left? Choco box to the bow accidentally kicks it. It falls off the map. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> the devil who got it from oh, my bow's back. Um, All right. So, is there anything else you want to do? You use your bonus action and action. Yeah, to heal. I'm. I've got to do the brave thing, and I'm gonna stand over here. I think. Okay. Uh, he smiles as you come, Mia. You forgot about me, hey? And he will stand over there. <laughs> That's the end of the turn. Okay, awesome. Alright, uh, after your turn, uh, Sadimos will turn, look at you. Uh, the, uh, Get it. Yagu, and uh, flames will rise from underneath your feet. Uh, I need you to make a dexterity saving throw, please. Get away! Throw. That's in a 20. <gasps> what? Nice. Got yep. nothing on this. Okay, <laughs> so uh, let me roll it just to make it fur, uh, fairer, shall I say. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, so half of 15 is 7, right? Yeah, so you take 7 points of necrotic damage. Uh, uh, it was already half, or was it half by rage as well? No, now, yeah, if you are raging, another half, so yeah, four, three, three, actually. Three, three, yeah. three. so three, three damage. damage. Nice. Yeah, nice. That's nothing. Okay. Yeah, and I will finish his legendary action. Uh, Mr. Moonbear, you are next. Before your right. turn starts, Mr. Moonbear, as you are within this, uh, within this um, aura, uh, you see the surging of electricity kind of kind of come towards you, and you take. Oh come on! Stop! I'm breaking you! Ah. <laughs> you only take seven <laughs> points of lightning damage. But that's without the rage, right? So it should be. You take half of half. that. So half three. Right. Thank three. you. <sighs> I get zapped. You do. Right. You get like a minor like. Shock. <laughs> yeah, but a minor shock is still bad news for me at this point. Right, oh, uh be a damage sponge. It's yeah, but I've used up all I'm using up those those precious spongy resources, so okay, so I've got three things I can do with still because of haste here. I'm going to ball. I need to find the sigil because apparently that's hidden now. So that's Arcana, is it? That is correct. Uh, do I know yep. what I'm looking for? I'm, I'm begging for advantage here. <laughs> uh, it's 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 the fact that it's hidden within this place that you're you're looking around seeking for it. You know, trying to find the magical essence, and then with that roll, no, you do not see it at the moment. All right, oh, no. can I can I use? I have say multiple actions to this. May I try again? Of course, yes. Yeah, you can use. Uh, that was your like free interaction to do it. Yep, free mm -hmm. interaction. Yeah. So, no, bonus action. Into... so you could use your bonus action if you want to try a second time. That is not enough. <sighs> oh my god. I'd like to use my action now. Mm -hmm. Does anyone have inspirations they can donate? No, yeah. I have uh, the 10. ten is I don't have two, enough. I only have the one. You have a 12, right. or anyone has anything to give you? No, that's been done. Thank like, you. Wow. I need to go Don't for a pee. <laughs> yeah, me too. I, I'm genuinely choking for a pee. Yeah. I'm also really yeah. annoyed at this. Should we, okay, should we so, go on a quick break? And yeah, why, why don't we go on a quick break? Yeah, because okay. the, 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 what is coming next, you need to be here because it's going to be on you, Bruce, and I, I'm bursting too. Going so maybe... to be on me? Really? <laughs> I mean, you got the scissors. You, I mean, I cannot. we cannot roleplay him more without him attacking you. I'm sorry. I'm trying my best to be fair. But yeah, why don't we just take a little break if everyone is cool with that? Mm -hmm. uh, so we'll take a quick 10 and we'll be right back. So... Thanks for watching, I'll see you guys soon.
right, thanks for watching. We are back live after a little break as we continue into our crazy fight as we last saw. Bruce Mumba just took his turn and then uh, mm -hmm. Sademos will look at him as an act of desperation. This is worth it. And you will see he starts moving his hand in this motion, like creating a, a circle, circular movement. And as he does, this ball of energy <laughs> keeps growing and growing and you recognize he's blasting a fireball. And he just release his hand and you see that the point on the fireball he's releasing it on himself too so i need him himself uh you bruce and uh yagu to make dexterity saving throws and the the hand as well you can do the hand more if you don't mind i'll do oh this. shit let's <laughs> use oh, my no. uh yeah inspiration for that one uh... oh no Oops. Well, see you, boys. Oh. Yep, <laughs> yeah. that was fun. Do either of you have the D12? No. Uh, did I've I got, get an I've extra one or no? I've got two inspiration. I oh, you did for your birthday. Mm -hmm. It is up, up to you, Ross. Oh, if you're giving it to anyone, me or, or or yeah. Mark. Yeah. No, I'll, I'll I'll give it I'll give it to uh, the hand to, to you, Andy. Yeah, and him, and him as well. Okay, so, <laughs> here we go. Make okay. again an advantage. And now we'll roll the damage. <laughs> the the, there's fire. a natural one on the other side. Oh, wow. hell. oh, nice. Okay, you are successful. So, based on what I roll, uh, this will make a difference. So, let's do it. Yagu fail? Back. Okay. Okay. Back 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 to Ross Kerry, ride and die. <laughs> so, I'll put it on the open just to make it more excruciating. Uh, 32. Oh, oh no, I rolled the average. 32, exactly the average. Okay, uh, so whoever succeeds, take half, 16, but it's and half then, again. Yeah, for rage. For 8, but uh, you, Yagu, uh, you're raging as well. You fail, so you will take 16. Uh, Zadimos will take 16 and the hand as well. Yeah, okay. what's the damage type? Radiant, it... radiant damage. <laughs> Just checking for you. Okay. Yeah, yeah. I, I was gonna say, how does this so... work with the swords? Uh, if they both fail, okay. they take 32, right? Uh, he, uh, he takes 6, he failed, so he takes 32, yeah. But then, yeah. Mm -hmm. Rage! And the hand as well. You, I was worried there for a second. <laughs> oh, You're not God. dead. You see, he's like he's so, so angry, frustrated. like his his eyes are so crossed, like they're getting narrow and narrow. But yeah, you're still alive, Harold Emerfield. Yeah. The camera moves to you. Bruises <laughs> <Bruce's laughs> chuck, chuckling. And then Harold's gonna get up, so half his movement's gonna be spent. So I don't know how to flip him upside up. So just keep that in yeah, mind. I'll, so uh, I'll I'll do that for you. Yep. So yeah, what you got a little gonna do? Thingy. There, you just have to that's, grab it. That's fine. Okay. So then half his movement is used. Okay, so okay. Errol's going to move 5, 10, 15, 20, right exactly there. So if somebody could move the token for me, please. Actually, no, I could keep track. Actually, I should do it. Oh, thank you. Okay, and then Errol just gasping for air practically. And could I see Zadimus, or is he just in this uh... black? No, um, no, I mean, there is, uh, you can still have sight on that. Okay. All right. See and seeing this, he's just. <sighs> okay. And then Errol's going to draw his dagger. Ensnaring strike. <laughs> and then uh, you'll just see vines slapped all over his arms, barely just pulsating at this point. And then you'll see him do the Call of Duty flip of the dagger. <laughs> And then yeah. he's going to chuck it at Zadimus. And it's going to be a normal roll because a sharpshooter. So instead of a disadvantage. Okay. Uh, so it's, normal he's, roll. Well, he's chucking the plus one dagger. Just to let you know. So for this okay. attack roll. Just for the purposes of this. And um, actually, you know, I'm going to use my inspiration to make it at advantage. Because I really want this to hit him. So the, my d20 inspiration. Natural 20, natural 20, natural 20, come on. Uh, that is a 17, but could I also use my D12 to add to it? Or is it because I used the D20, it's already null and void? Two separate things, aren't they? Okay, Self so D12, okay, I'm going to use the D12 I got. That's a D10, like that. D12, okay. 
Uh, that's going to be a 17 plus 6. That is going to be 23 to hit. Does that hit him? Uh, 23 to hit. Uh, yeah. Yeah, that will actually hit him normally. And yeah. uh, I am going to... Shield. So, yeah. And I I'm like going the way you to... hesitate on that, Cisco. <laughs> he was debating using shield, but I just yeah. want you to know that since Daring Even Strike Even with a shield, you will hit him. This Ensnaring Strike is going to be at second level. I should have mentioned that, but... Okay, perfect. So he needs to make a DC 14 strength saving throw, please. Or... Or he will be ensnared by vines. So I mean, should have gave see, him disability. You see on. that uh, as the vines kind of like wrap around him, he just looks at them, he smiles at you, and the vines turn into ash, and he, as he is uh, immune to being restrained. He still will take whatever damage or something, if there is some, but he cannot there be is, restrained. He's immune to being restrained? Yeah. He is. His condition immunity, one of them, is restrained. So, yeah. Uh -huh. All right. Well, uh -huh. that Sorry is for that. fine. <laughs> no worries. Um, so in that case, that's going to be six piercing from the dagger plus... Where is, is it? it? The poison? Uh, any it's, poison in there? It's piercing from okay. the pier the poison I never activated on the dagger. So oh, the poison perfect. and um, the piercing from the ensnaring strike. It was eight. So six plus eight, that is fourteen. Fourteen. Yeah. Okay. Yep. So yeah. So he will take fourteen points of damage. You yeah. see, he he's going to poison him. He. I would have had to use my bonus action to activate the thing. Do you which... want to go back and do that? No, well, because I used ensnaring strike, so I would have to go back completely on that. Oh, okay, okay. Full turn. So then, uh, so then, forget about yeah. it. Yeah, okay. Yeah. No worries. And in that case, that okay, that's all I could do. Sorry about that, guys. I thought I could do it. I thought that would work. No, right, no, so no that's, that's, that's the end of the yeah. turn. Cool, cool. All right, and as your uh, as your turn finish, we move back to Zadimus again uh, with this last legendary action. Now or never. No, Actually, yeah. He doesn't Go have ahead. it. I thought he used them all. He yeah. used them all. He oh used yeah, he used. Oh yeah, he used, he used one two. and two. Yeah, yeah. No worries. Yeah, no legendary actions for him. All right. Uh, Ruin behind the monolith. <laughs> uh, hidden <laughs> away, picking. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, it's good. Come on, hey. We have to play by the rules. Uh, definitely. No, no. I, feel like it's, I, I just feel like it's important to get to that other half of me. So I'm just gonna. Like the hamster, meme. You know, you see that hamster with the Coca Cola can. I'm gonna move Ruin right here. And I will. Can I use my interaction to pick up the bow? Mm -hmm. Or uh, sure, the yeah, feet below me. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Actually, it, it, no, because I'm flying up there. It's ten feet below me. Okay, yeah, you want to go down? Uh, get it? I mean, you can go down. Yeah. I really want to do. It. Yeah, I wanted to get close to me, but. I right, I have a turn that leave it. I'll do it. Okay, I'll leave it to you. Uh, I really want to get close to me over there. But I will. <laughs> Use my no, because I need to do damage this round. I'm gonna use a third level guiding bolt. Could you not? Could you reach the the bubble there and have a look for the uh, the sigil rather than hurting him? Because he'll then heal himself and this, do more damage. You already, to the you already, de you already dispelled this one with the scissors. Um, I was just meaning um, talking about the one, one that he's in. Yeah, it's from where I'm at, can I see? See what you will have to. Let's say you could. You haven't used your bonus action, right? I, I mean, if not. you do, you have enough movement to get to the sigil. Let's I've used all of my movement to get okay, to where I'm at. So then, so then uh, you have to be within the the sigil. I mean, the blackened area to actually see the. It's fine. The I'm going to there. just try and murder so we'll refer that. the thing next to you. Okay. I'm gonna. I'm going to twin spell. I can't twin spell Shield of Faith, can I? We discussed this. It's a touch, mm. right? Uh, no, it's 60 feet. And you can. Yeah. If it can targets can. a single creature. Yeah. Then yeah. I will... 30, 40, perfect. I will... Uh, bonus action, I'll take out two, two like, talismans, two spell tags, and I'm going to just flick them out at Yagu and, um, Bruce. Bruce. Yep. And they have a plus two to their ACs. Okay, oh, nice. And then I will action, um, 
That is. Eldritch oh, the Blast. Hex, uh, the Hex spells off. I will action Eldritch Blast. Uh, These three or two, whichever one. Yeah, I need to start killing those around Aki, don't I? Yeah, I would. Um, preferably the one attached if we're metagaming this. I'm going to, yeah, I was going to say, I'm, <laughs> I'm going to hit the one that's attached to Aki, and I'm going to say, Aki, you don't mind losing a hand, do you? And I'm just going to take out the, the, the poison, um, I'm sorry, the, the sword. Thumb, and I'm gonna... The thumb, the thumb, the whole thing. <laughs> I'm no. gonna. I'm gonna put up two Eldritch Blasts, uh, slash. No meta gaming, by the way, but it's a dumb dumb. Blast on eyeballs. Oh, yeah! Ooh. That's nice. nice. Roll damage. Nice. Can whoever had access to my sheet oh. earlier make my armor class 20, please? Uh, that's 8 plus 8, so. 16? 16 damage? 16? Does it explode? 16 damage? 16? Is not enough! He is one Dang HP. It. Well, the, uh, your fault for not picking the uh, the other thing with it. What's it called? The uh, Eldritch Invocation. Uh, <laughs> agonizing Blast. I can see Luke's face. I can see Luke's face. Honestly, it's been pissing me off since he made the character. It's the, it's the one. It's the one invocation every warlock picks. I remember it's it's a, it wasn't Jay Feather a druid who couldn't do druid craft or something. Yeah. <laughs> The list I goes on and on and on. I don't know. I don't know whether you guys out the, were. Out of the I other three, out of the other three, do any of them look injured? Only the one you've hit. Then I will, I will hit it again okay. with another Eldritch Blast. Excellent. Does a thirteen <laughs> hit? Oh, yeah, no. The. No, I've still got time. I've still got time. I, I, I miss it, and that's fine by me. <laughs> and I'm just gonna look down at Ziggy and be like. Fucking stop laying down. Right, well, you're dead, you know that. All right. I've already told you, I can show you when you live or die. Okay, you're dead. And as, uh, as you said that, uh, the camera moves again towards you, Siggy. Uh, this is round seven now. Okay, before your turn, Siggy, I'm gonna distract, I'm gonna tell you something happens. You begin to see the monolith glow. And as no. it glows, you well those that are within the circles you see uh, bruce you see aki's mum wincing in a lot of pain and you expect the other four also having the same effect it seems like the ritual is coming to a close very soon it's your turn now Diggy. go ahead Oh, we're about to have another bruised dad moment. Please help me find these sigils. <laughs> I mean, I'm gonna do what I was originally planning on doing. I can go use a, um, a healing word at third level on uh, Bruce. Uh, give me one moment. That's um, yeah, that's 17 points of healing. Just one second, quickly. Something. Uh, 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 uh. You know what? Yep. As you start casting your spell, Sadimos looks at you and says, No, I've been waiting for hundred years for today. You lot are not going to ruin it for me. And your spell falls on the floor. That's a big move, Cisco. I'm not going to get angry. Cisco is, not he, Cisco is not here. Just I, think of I, this. I, I forget see Cisco. Cisco. I can forget see, Cisco. I can, I can see Cisco. Cisco is not here. <laughs> this is Sadimos. Hey, it happens. Oh, did he use this Cisco? Is only. Did he use Candice Bell? Yeah. Mm -hmm. okay. Wait, didn't he use his reaction on something else? Last a few turns before that. No, not yeah. this time. He used his legendary resistance, but yeah, I don't know about the was, reaction. Yeah. That's why it was. Um, he wants Bruce to go down because if he doesn't go down and he finishes the ritual, the ritual will stop. So in that he, case, he doesn't want him to have more hit points. In that case, I can't do much because um, there's a bonus action for back inspira inspiration. I can't do that. So just gonna stand up with 15 feet of movement. Uh, move. No, it's not moving. 
I'm going to move five feet here to grab uh, the bow with my free action. Then move an extra ten feet closer to Harold. But you still have a you still have an action, so yeah. I'm going to do something with that. You uh, don't, well, Harold. So I, you can I, take a shot with the bow if you want. I, actually, wait. Can he? It's attuned to me. Never mind. I don't know if he actually can. And it I doesn't need an arrow. Oh, never mind. Do you have any cantrips or anything you can use? Vicious mockery. Could you throw the bow, Harold? That might be helpful, actually. Vicious mockery. I could. Uh, I could throw the bow, but honestly, mm. but with no strength, with a minus one strength score, it's not gonna work. You could do it uh, with your. In you haven't used your interaction, so you could yeah, definitely. I could, I could. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on. Yeah. Mm -hmm. He had a stand. I have a minus one strength. But I can you give it a go if you want. Yeah. Uh -huh. I can miss, miss 20 feet, but yeah, I can try. I'll I'll try and throw it. Yeah, just mm -hmm. there, 15 feet, yeah. yeah. Uh, is it strength? Uh, I will let you choose see the strength of dexterity because it's a range thing, so whichever one is best for you. 19. Okay. And that's to throw it towards him. Yeah, as you throw it, it lands right there uh, next to you, Harold. Thank you. Interaction. You still have your action, though. Uh, in that case, I'm gonna take out the pearl. Yeah, the spell slot back. Ooh, okay. So, yep, that's it. Alright, cool, cool. And after your turn, Ziggy, it will be Sadimon's turn. <laughs> Alright. It's end time now. Uh, I'm gonna roll it in the open to see if he recharges his tentacle. Come on. No, One or two. Okay, <laughs> cool. He does not recharge his tentacle. Uh, so, like on this case, uh, he will actually, uh, you will see the flames wraith uh, from below you, uh, Bruce. As I need you to make a dexterity saving throw, he will use uh, unholy flames on you. Mm -hmm. Did we establish if you have advantage on that? I yeah. do because it's a deck, it's a spell effect. Yeah, yeah, it's deck. Yeah. You can see it. Cool. Mm -hmm. Okay, so Step you up. save, so you take 13 points of damage that is reduced again uh, to 6. <laughs> yep, 6 and nice. 7, yep. Mm -hmm. uh, but this is so painful for me, uh, seriously, guys. As players, uh, I hope you feel sorry for hey, me. Just I just gotta it. survive. Oh, these dudes! I actually, no, I, actually don't it. I actually don't enjoy. It at all. We're, we're all we're all doing good here, guys. We're all gonna be guys, 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 guys. 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 <laughs> well, let's keep moving. Let's keep moving. <laughs> let's go. Okay. Wish, let's keep going. And he will do when Then after that, he will use uh, try to. Enter your mind with this uh, psychic uh, attack thing, uh, using his psychic whisper attack on you as well, Bruce. Yeah, this is not going to be great. Wisdom <laughs> save, right? If I remember correctly. Yeah, it's, oh, a, it's, it's, a, it's an attack oh. first. Yeah. Oh. oh my god! Make a fake okay. <laughs> Ah Yes, sure. Let's uh, say hi. You see his <gasps> mind kind of focus. <laughs> And then out of the sudden, you see the hand like twitches, like <laughs> as the hand actually takes the damage. I'm gonna say it doesn't even do what a save. Fucking it's... damage. And yep. Wow, oh, well, you surviving? Okay. How? I guess the gods, the gods are helping me. You see, to be after to be this, merciful. he's getting his first level of yeah. strength. After he, this, seeing his hand twitching, Bruce will yeah. see him. Don't, don't worry, happens to a lot of folk your age. Perfect, <laughs> perfectly oh, normal. No. Damn. How okay. much damage? And that will, yeah, and I think that will be actually. Oh yeah, no, he's got his, the hand bonus action too. Actually, uh, just to be fair. Oh no, no, no! How much health yeah, does that have? He's taken so uh, much. So it's one more. Hold on, more. to his health. So. so this is the damage that the hand takes. Actually, okay, cool. Yeah, so sixteen. All right. All right. And then lastly, he will try to punch you with the big beast hand thingy, Begnat's hand. Your AC is your ACS plus two. Remember, yeah, uh, plus I two, remember, uh, I remember. Oh my god! Yep, and the hand <laughs> goes like, you know, and it kind of like goes through. At this point, as that happens, the rest of the jaw that was dangling just falls <laughs> on the floor. Watch him out! Can't speak anymore. Crashes like into smithereens as he's like. I can't believe that. 
Yep, and that finishes actually amazing, guys. What Very the cool. fuck? Um, they fucked the, the fuck? fucking hell. Yep, has, yep. Has he been saving this concentration, by the way? Because that fireball. Hand oh yeah, that's a very good point actually. Yeah, that is crazy, uh, he, yes. ha he has advantage on them though, but let's see. You never know. <laughs> Double well, fives. I don't yeah. know what his what his, what his con score uh, is though. Uh, let me just see. I don't think he can make it. To be it's honest. not that good. Nope, uh, he's not that good. Uh, actually, let's take back the baby hand vanishes. <laughs> nice. <laughs> What is going? Oh, what a fuck is not going well for him this no, round? I'm just gonna give it to the parasites. Yeah. Okay. And that will finish his Can we, we flame this? Is not entirely his fuck ups, but like Bruce's eyes have a silver glow to them again. Mm. Like he's even he's not even aware of it because he thought that prayer did fuck all. <laughs> yeah, I think I think somehow like uh, Sadimus can feel the power of Selun within you, and he's starting to be worried. You see this kind of like desperation on his eyes, like as pieces of him keep falling and he looks at you like getting stronger and stronger like you know one of these hulking oh, moments I really okay <laughs> 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 alrighty um, and the Zenimus is dead action okay yeah, no, that's, that's Aki, gonna be it Aki. for him roll me a d6 please Aki save Ooh. me <laughs> I'm trying to remember which one was the one that just twisted the terrain around two I think it was like a four well has Ooh. two ever happened I don't think it has. That's a new one. No? Nothing happens. Yes, nothing, nothing. Move on. I, I want to say okay. the old gets to go home. Yeah, that's, that's a new one. Yeah, yeah. That's a new one. I don't remember what space we decided. Did we just? Uh, he, we said that uh, he could cast it whatever he wants. Oh, he can pick oh, it as, pick as, bad. Bad. as long as he's within range. You know, like if he was coming from him, kind of thing. Yeah. Okay. Um. Who do we pick? Oh, yeah. Of course. Uh. uh <laughs> You see, hmm, hmm, yeah. I think well, I gotta, I gotta do it to, to, to. Yeah, uh, you see him kind of turn towards Aki, and uh, he kind of oh. looks towards you, and as he, he just looks at you, be silent, and you see your lips begin to melt together and merge. Oh, as you are, as he takes away feeds your voice you are silenced until the next round until the next round we have a cupcake yeah. in front of them guys we have a cupcake <laughs> 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 um, and as that happens you feel the pain of the uh, the parasites beginning to wail on you the one that's attached to you you take eight points of uh, necrotic damage and the other two yeah. are trying to cling on to you. First one. Do I go down? Me. Not you. Not yet. I'm getting to use in a second. Uh, Fifteen does not hit you. No. And then nope. the other one is a twenty. Shield. Shield. Okay. Great. Uh, so that one doesn't hit you either. Great. So the only one still clung, clinging on to you. The one is dead. And then the one on you, Harold. Where is he? Ruined. And you? Uh, no, I'm not gonna say anything. Mm, yeah, I think you, you, you are definitely. He's gonna use his consumed life on you, and you take ugh, 16 points of necrotic damage. All right, I am down again, boys. But also, uh, it was, uh, uh, Ross, what are the components of shield? Oh. Uh, verbal and somatic. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I'm sorry. And what is um? How does that interact with Warcaster? Oh, never mind. Do you... Oh yeah, because you don't need to use. Yeah. Well, you don't need no, these. No, 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 no. You still need oh, the verbal. Yeah, I still need the that's verbal. That's fun. true. Yeah. Yeah. Subtle, but so it's no shield. No shield. Yeah. All right, then you take uh 14 points of necrotic damage, and you have another one now attached to you. An additional 14 or 14 total. Uh, the first one you took eight. Was eight. And then this is a 14 for the one that you shielded. It's an additional 14. Yeah. yeah. I'm sorry, guys. That's cool. No, Thank you so much. It's fine. No, no, like them, them's the rules. Them's the rules. Okay. I'll and hold I think. That against you, Sniper Joy. Yeah. <laughs> right. It is your turn. No Silent Dragon. Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> seeing things are going to shift up here. Ak Aki will look around to Dulthir. I'm assuming this works, by the way. Uh, and then. 
holding the uh, the pommel of uh, Pathmaker will think of, think of uh, his mom and dimension door there using Pathmaker. Your dimension door underneath the the to where Zulthir is? Not to where uh, mom is. So here. Oh, yes. I guess I is that could. something I can do? Above yeah. ground or below ground? Below the ground where she is, I think. Specify. Above. <laughs> <laughs> That's fair. Um, well, on the same at the same altitude as Indeed. I currently am. <laughs> okay. okay. He does not want to go below. He does yeah. not no. want. To... All right. Where do you want to go exactly? Point it. Well, I'll go uh, here. Here. Oh yes, and I'll I'll take my new pets with me. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Someone finally shut you up, Aki. <laughs> <laughs> Aki's, Aki's a, a mix of uh, <laughs> sarcastic anger at that. Actually, <laughs> on that note, could you display uh, Dimension Door for us? I mean, the, the sword's yeah. casting the spell, so I don't think it needs any of the normal components. It's through, it's, yeah, it's through the item. It's something else. Uh, okay. I can bring along objects as long as their weight does not exceed what I can carry. Uh, the creatures, actually, uh, one creature, a willing creature. You are not willing. You don't want to take anyone, do you, Zaki? Actually, uh, <laughs> no, thank this. you. But, so I think, as per the spell, the creatures will stay where you were. Oh, we have. Well, we've I'm already checking. ruled that with vortex warp, they went with error. Yeah. Okay, so let's I say if, I, I leave I leave this with more actually to the side. I think DM Cisco okay. is trying to be kind. Why don't you just make a fate roll? No, I'm yeah, not sure enough. Okay, yeah, <laughs> let's, let's do that actually. <laughs> uh, well, always high. Okay. Hey. All right. So as you so, sit, let's say for now. Um, I'm as alone. We rolled it before. They stay there. The traveler's right. with him. Yep. He is. Action spent. Uh, interaction. Looking for a sigil. Go ahead. Make a... Arcana? Yep. Do you have that d12 stuff? No. But that might do. Immediately you see uh, like a trickling of electricity <laughs> creating a sigil just behind you right there. And Bruce, you also see that as well. No, Fucky I... just... <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Oh, speak up. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> uh, with my bonus action, would you allow me to uh, swipe the the scissors and go and snip my mum free? Bonus action? No, that's you'll have what to I use have to, left. You, you, you'll have to use an action to 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 scissor the sigil. As <laughs> <I would> say. <laughs> God, I'm right. Freaking arm. Now, um, furiously looking through all of my spells, realizing every single one of them needs something verbal. That's unfortunate. Um, I don't have a great deal. Yeah, everything. Oh, God. There is... There's nothing I can do with my bonus action. Put that um, sword to use. Uh, Aki, I'm just going to tell yes. you that right now. That's what playing a bard is like. <laughs> but, for Aki, uh... I need you to do something really important for me. Distract him! <laughs> Okay, uh, <laughs> Aki, it's like, okay, fuck it. Aki will run over here and flip him the double birds. <laughs> <laughs> what would your mom else think? Yeah. What would your mom you think? see, like, uh, he's, he's doing that. Joel he's up, apologetic yeah. eyes. Joel Sorry, Mom. Uh, Stadimus uh, looks at you, uh, looks at Bruce once more, and, no. and you can see on his eyes that the moment is close and he's desperate. Uh, this time, just to make it more interesting, he doesn't know you guys have Hero's Fist and you're immune to be frightened, does it? He, no. I would imagine he wouldn't. Yeah. We did it beforehand. Yeah. So, so he That's will right. he will look at you, Bruce, and you will feel the intensity of his eyes as he starts to cast Nightmare Gaze on you. You will need to succeed on a saving throw or being frightened of him for a minute. But so I'll make you do a deception check, actually. Uh, oh. to see and that will determine after this if you are failed then he will know that there is something going on you know 
as oh, he's okay. kind of like doing like ah, you know and you see him like so intensely like you know so you you can role play out if you want so to make it fun <laughs> he just shakes wow. his head and he's like nah i've seen worse than you you're ugly but <laughs> far worse than you oh, God. And you see, like, angrily, and that will be his legendary, first yeah, legendary it, action. Haven't you, haven't you seen this by now? You don't scare me at all. <laughs> he crashes, he steps on his jaw by mistake. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> like, your attacks that. ain't shit, your spells ain't shit, your hand was not shit, you're shit to me! You're nothing! <laughs> yeah, very if, if, if he doesn't have his jaw, how does he cast verbal? Oh no, he's, 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 an eldritch, he's an Eldritch Leaf. So he doesn't you know. need to speak, actually. Yeah, he's he, just he flavored. Flavor, yeah. He has a flavor yeah. he's given us with the. Yeah. You remember when he did the oh, the oh, evil monologue? He was using both, you know? Yeah. I just cool, picture cool. his being like. Ah, 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 ah. <laughs> what are you like doing? those old games where they yeah. had subtitles. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> yeah, black speeches need you to go blah blah blah. That's all it needs. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, sorry about that, Yago. Go ahead. No, yeah, that's that's right. that. <laughs> <laughs> you got a lot you can do here, man. You could do damage, do anything you want. Oh, I think yeah. you just need you, to. You could check to see what the sigil is here if we need that. You could do that also. Yago is the smartest of the group, but then he gets an attack of opportunity. That's, hmm. Takes away his reaction. Maybe. Or I could just start he, bumping he have, some damage have, because... He attacks with his technical thing, right? Yeah. Like, I can either you. check it or I can start dealing some damage you. because we have to do that at some point anyway. That's true, that's true. Just fuck him up. Yeah, Joku will up. say... Oh, yeah, Joku will... Uh, Don't you dare pull you back to me and he will... Attack recklessly! Oh, uh, no, of course. <laughs> um, I'm gonna waste an inspiration for that one. Oh. Okay. Reroll it. Okay, so yeah, we uh, take the 15 and you reroll on that. Oh, okay. Yeah, okay. 24. Yeah, that will definitely hit. Um, you will see that he will have cast shield, but it is not, doesn't matter. You hit him anyway. So now he's gonna 23 AC. Fine. You wanna mm -hmm. put a smite in there? Wait, did he, did he cast shield or not? Um, in the no, no, he so. will hit. He will hit him even with the shield. Okay, so he didn't cast yeah. it. So he didn't cast it. But I like it's the only form of healing I have left through my spell. So should I waste them on smites? That's the problem. It's up to you. I man. can still heal. Do not worry about it. You could also use your second attack to try and grapple him so he can't move after me when I try to m move away from him. So, but also, he it'd be a straight athletic roll because he's bigger, but you're raging. Room. It's up to you. Now nah, I'll go for full damage. So okay, um, I'm not gonna smite this one. I'm keeping it. Uh, second attack. Oof, twenty-one to it. Before your second attack, you will see that Sadimos looks towards where you, where the rest of you are, past uh, Ziggy and past uh, Ruin. <laughs> And he kind of like vanishes into a puff of smoke and he leaves behind Mo, who will describe to us uh, what happens. Mm -hmm. And is as he does, this is a reaction. This is his reaction he's using. Mm -hmm. So you want to move him wherever he's going to move to? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Cool. I'll do that. Please be far away from me. Okay, one second before I fully decide. I need to check his movement speed. But yeah, you you uh, describe what is happening in the meantime. Okay. okay. Yeah. I just need to drop it in the square. Okay. So I'll just measure one second because I want to make sure he can reach afterwards. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Yeah. So he goes to the top of the map, kind of 60 feet away. Around there. Sorry, I'm just. Where is Excellent. He's at, our, he's at our latest health tank. Perfect. Nice. <laughs> Good job, Ruin. You got this. All right. Uh, you see him kind of disappear into kind of like a, 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 a. Like he's being sucked into some sort of black hole. And as he does. You, he disappears from sight and leaving something like a black hole there, like an orb. And as he does, you feel it kind of oh, pulling, no. pulling in towards you. Um, 
you don't have to make anything at the moment, but you feel this kind of pull towards this this orb as it appears. Okay. That's it's all just pulls a bit. And there's nothing. Not at the moment. No. Okay. Sure. You, you can still move, can't you? Yeah, yeah I you can move get towards to him. Actually, yeah, you can reach him. Or I can just go do whatever I have to do. You could make an inside check if you want, Yago. Actually, sure. Inside, where are you at? Normal roll inside. Let's go. Eighteen. You yes. start to see on his face that even though he really believes on himself and he's really confident, what the things that had happened on the last few seconds, he start. You see a tiny bit of fear on his face as pieces of him keep falling, and you can see now that he doesn't seem to be regenerating as much anymore. Oh. So you are starting to realize that he's actually probably scared a little bit. Even though he wants to stop you, he wants to leave too. So it's a bit of a conflict within him. Sorry, I would need That's to. Uh, a... I need to. Uh, um, sorry, I should have explained. While you're in this space, mm, you ahead. are. Uh, you are. Uh, it's considered as difficult terrain. So, so how far? Um, I want to see if I can show you it. I'm trying to click on it, but it's not letting me. Bd 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 bd. Can I show? See? I clicked on see. Can you see it now? Yes. Yeah, okay, we can see it now. Yep. Oh, so it's only one step. That's good. <laughs> yeah. Well, that's all Jogu needs um, to know that he's and... in fear and only one step. That's 10. And then from here to there, that's 30. Mm -hmm. Oh, wait. Is this also? Yeah. I'm going to take one step more to the left in case of tentacle creatures and. Uh, yeah, then I would have done my second attack. Do you want me to reward? or just use the one I used? Um, let's say you can use the one because it's fair, you know? It doesn't matter. So yeah, yeah the other I want to fish for critical hits, so I don't mind. <laughs> nope. Uh, let's say, you know, well, if you really want to, you go ahead, but you could miss, you know, up to you. Yeah, yeah but yeah, I'll use this reaction to shield. The odds are more in my favor to crit, I think. So, yeah, I think go ahead. Go ahead. You it's your better there. Come on. How can oh, I say no this? <laughs> yeah. I'm going to re-roll. I'm going to re-roll. Okay, yeah. It's, it's higher, so. Yeah. Uh, he's got no reaction, so yeah. Okay. All together, so, 19 yeah, that points. Would be, uh, and I'm going to level one smite to this one then. Ooh, okay. Level one smite to rule for an extra nine. All right. He's undead, so it's three, one extra three, die. Three, oh, an extra die. Okay. Yeah, he's yeah. undead. Very undead. An extra six to that? Very undead. So, <laughs> Very 15. Undead. so 15 plus 19. Yeah, I've done it. Yep. Amazing. Okay, and then uh, bonus action uh, quick step rule. Um, let's hope. Oh, that was almost. Okay. Oh, and then another level one smite to it. To it. Okay. Ooh, that's a high roll. Oh, nice. Okay, you as you keep hitting him for a, you look at him for a second and you see this kind of black ooze that pours out of him. It's not really blood. It's similar to what you saw outside on the on the terrain, like a disgusting kind of life force necrotic ooze. All right. Oh, it's disgusting piece of shit, and that's it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, that also added plus two from rage from the last attack. Okay, yeah, so tell us how much. Uh, so, plus, uh, plus four. So, 30, four, yeah. 33 plus damage from the last one. So, it's plus two okay. for each hit, right? Yes. Yeah, so. Yeah. Minus so six. Plus six in total from the end. Yeah, okay. plus four total. Yeah. Okay, cool, cool. All right. Oh, uh, God. Anything else from Yago? Yeah, he's starting to look bloodied. Uh, no, he will just literally stand there with. Yeah. You will see the silhouette of uh, Fire Panther constantly behind him at this point. He's fully raging. Yeah. All right. <clears throat> cool. Um, you finish your turn there? Yeah. All right. Once more, Bruce, as Yagu keeps plummeting into this creature, he still raises his hand once more. And silvery f mist kind of rises from underneath you. I need you to make a dexterity saving throw. This is uh, a I fuck this up is there. a spell. Actually, I need to mention uh, this is a spell as well. That's yeah, it's a spell effect. Really it makes a, a difference. Oh, Aki, if I fuck up, be prepared to pick pick up these scissors. Natural twenty. <laughs> <gasps> Whoa. <gasps> okay. This is really turned. 
<laughs> oh god. Yeah. You want, do you That's want avalanche or you want rock? I mean, I'll... I have four health, so if this is only half damage, I'm gonna go down anyway. So you might as well I mean... roll. See if uh, all right. At four HP, if you roll, can you get can you get him below four? Doesn't matter. I could <laughs> actually get below four. No, no you can with four D10s. No, you can't. <laughs> you could get two. Yeah. Uh, yeah, no, not below four. Yeah, but it's yeah, used to half, so it's two. Oh Would no, you have only two. Bruce goes down. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So that would be eleven. Eight. Eleven is half to five. Yeah. Oh God! No. It was my okay. turn next. God, uh, someone get the uh, scissors. Fuck! Both he has miles. down too. Yes. Well, just you could roll a natural twenty. Who knows? Again. Sure, I guess. Um, uh, well, I can't do the whisper thing though because I can't do the W on my keyboard. That's... So I'm gonna have to, have to make this public. I'm sorry. Yeah. yeah no uh, worries. It's no worries. It's cool. Oh, I'm so torn. 19, of course, it was a, f a fuck off roll 20. Oh, Suck no, dick. almost, damn it. <laughs> well, it's gonna get worse as you are in the f still in the field. You f get shocked by the lightning around. You take one death save immediately. Isn't it two? No, no it's just one. Oh. Do and it because, and because you, you can't make the death save, um, you can't make any strength saving throws, your body gets dragged towards this gravitational orb. You just see it just gets pulled towards. What? It, all all the way? Not even five foot? Just gone? You just moved that into the middle of the gravity thing. Okay. All right. Well, the scissors are oh, uh, here. Just... Hold up. Let me see where it's about. Yeah, it's in the token there. Can you see it? You can see it. Mhm. Mm yeah. Mhm. Mm right. Um. Errol's turn. Make a death save, I guess. <laughs> no, don't worry about it. I'm on it. I'm on it. Um. Okay, whisper. Here it is. That's how you do it. Okay. Okay. Cool. I already got down on my turn. Okay. Um. And then uh, after your turn, I Errol, uh, we just go Ru and left there as well. You'll so, literally yeah. see Ruins mm -hmm. just like biting his nails because he's looking at his like image of himself. But then he sees the other two are down. Ah, oh, this is it's so painful. <laughs> I've been I've been trying since the beginning of this game to get to this fucking circle and I got teleported yeah. and do, do what you want. I would say just to just to kind of give you some guidance, make a just make a arcana check, just a general arcana check. Okay, 14. yeah, fourteen, fourteen is enough. The the connection has been broken to the circle that your kind of let's say your soul is in. So and the fact that it's it's broken doesn't seem like it's in any longer in any harm plus you would notice that because you're not taking any more damage when he heals but you realize that there is still danger in the other ones and if this ritual is not stopped something bad potentially could happen that's what i'm just going to tell you right now your next move is very important I could save Aki's mom. Or You've got to do, do the sigil, because we, we, if we stop the ritual, you'll save your soul. <laughs> On Sadimo's face, you see desperation. He's just like completely don't know what to do to a point that he actually forgot his legendary action because I'm just doing that for flavor because he's so desperate that he doesn't know mm -hmm. what to do. So he's going to do it after your turn. So your turn will decide the whole thing. No pressure at all, Lucky. <laughs> God, man. Forget, oh, good, yeah. bit, good buddies as well. But a kiss family's you... life might be in your hands after all. You know what? I'm gonna do this because they used to do it all the time. Can I do? A, can I? Can I give myself a wisdom saving throw? Sure. See if I give in to temptation. That's mean. That's, That's really mean. Whoa. That's fucking mean. I'm sorry. It's up to you. Yeah. No, it's, it's up to Lucky. Don't worry about it. Yeah. Just do whatever. Yeah, it is. Yeah, yeah, you want to make a decision yeah, yourself, you, you do whatever you do. Yeah. We'll it's it's really hard. I'm just going to leave it to a coin toss. It's. I'm going to... 
what's the, what's the out, what's the outcomes? What yeah. are you looking for? If it's high, I'll go for it. If it's low, I'm gonna stay. Fuck. There's a ten to high. I think a, te a ten is high. Yeah. Ten is high. I'll yeah. I'll be right back. I'll look at them and just look back at my soul and say, ah, oh, fuck, they're ruining me. Yeah. <laughs> be right back. I will. Yeah, no worries. Can you mark where the scissors are? Bruce, where, uh, where Bruce yeah, yeah, right. I was standing here. Mm -hmm. Okay, I right. will <laughs> mark one above. Together. 5, 10, 15, 20, Boys, 25, difficult 30. Difficult terrain. Oh, unless you're flying. flying. I'm flying. Oh, okay. Um, <laughs> let I'm, me just make sure. If I knew it was difficult terrain, could I go around it and go here yeah. instead? You see that the actual, the visual effect is like a black hole that is actually open and you saw uh, Bruce rolling inside it, so yeah. Can I oh, use no. my action to dash and my interaction to pick up the scissors and then I know... You... No, you can't do it then. Yeah, that's the thing. I'll let you go back and think again if you want, you know, because... Uh... Mm -hmm. Because I it can't. takes an action to use the scissors, so I can't pick up the scissors then. Oh. No, they, they, to pick them up is an interaction, so you can't pick them up, but then it's an action to use them. Aki's so if right you there. dash, if you dash, well, Aki could do it, but then that will that will be the next round. So the monolith flash is still flashing now. So can you damage the sigils? No, uh, we can roll it out there. We tried. I tried. You can dis. You can dispel them. Oh, I don't have any got, dispels. I got fireballed earlier and it did nothing. That's fine. Just want to ask. God, I've been doing. My turns are so smooth up to this point. I'm sorry, guys. You saw that the sigil. Uh, l l actually, I'll give you this for free. When you hit the sigil uh, last time, every time we describe the sigil, there is a different type of energy around it. So this one is an necrotic energy, as we were mentioning, uh, we'll I believe. Uh, so then that would that could have been the reason why it didn't get damaged before. And also, you guys know that there is a certain amount of damage minimum as well to actually damage it. So it's a bit tricky. One. Do you have anything, anything that, that does radiant yep. damage? My guiding bolt that I was. I would recommend using maybe Guiding Bolt on it. If we can't cut it, we might as well bless you know it the that, that hard works, way. Because I could still do what I want. I'm going to go yeah. 5, 10, 15, Oops. 20, 25. And I want to use my interaction to touch my soul. As you reach gonna, down. Yeah, this one is got, a, is got a lightning and thunder aura on this sigil. Uh, my apologies before you said anything. Uh, this is number, yeah. So this one, is, you saw lightning and thunder. So you could assume that's the kind of maybe magic you need to use. What's going on? I've lost. Question mark. Ruan is trying to decide what to do. So there is different things that, that he's discussing and how to make it there and how to use the scissors and all that. Still... <laughs> So yes. he was gonna. We were discussing because Sigi used hit the the sigil before, but it didn't take the damage. And I was explaining that the auras of the different sigils have like a certain uh, lightning, necrotic, or different things. So that could be the reason why. So my plan is, I I wanna I wanted to use my movement to get to my soul, use my interaction to touch it or grab my soul, and then I'm gonna use my action to. Twin spell, my last uh my last sorcery point, a first level guiding bolt, one at Zadimus and one at the um sigil down here. Is that possible? And which which kind of energy will that be? Radiant. You, you, said it was saw, you saw that uh on this space earlier on, uh there is lightning and thunder, and you saw this lightning actually affecting um Bruce. Lightning. Yeah. I... The I, only lightning I have, the only lightning I have is the Wand of Wonders. That's no. not that's not an option. <laughs> I feel like that's not an option. So, uh, twinning, this, the wording of twinning uses the word creature. Yeah. So, never mind, we couldn't even do that anyway. Um, as, per, as per this, uh, as you can target this, let's say that if you wanted to do that, that could be an option. 
the problem it might be the type of energy as well rather than anything else as that it was necrotic that's why i suggested yeah. it so I this one is lightning or thunder you can see it. Oh, he's taking a call he's taking a call yeah. sorry yeah no, last okay. thing. alexa turn on the office light we'll come back to his turn no, 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 i'm back i'm back oh you're back you're back I'm back sorry about that can um, i can i okay so Currently, you have to be in the circle to see the sigil itself, so you won't be able to even hit it from wherever you are. Yeah, that's... So, um, in terms of that, but tell us what you want to do. I won't be able to reach it anyways, so I'm just going to run for my soul. Okay. And I will reach out and touch my soul. Alright. Okay. You reach uh, down I'm... and touch your soul, and the soul looks up to you, reaches up, but nothing happens. Currently, it's still yeah. trapped within the, within the, within this ritual, and unless it's broken, it will not be released. I thought it was released once the scissors. It's still no. trapped under the floor. It's trapped yeah. under the floor. Free from the ritual. Yeah. The dead is why broken. Said we in a, in a pod. Ritual. It's in a pod. Well, I couldn't reach the scissors. It's okay. It's Honestly, okay. I would just guiding bolt his ass just to make something of the turn. If he can't get to the scissors, yeah, you yeah, might as well. I will. Pigeon. I will. Yeah. My my last third level guiding bolt. Yep. And I okay. will. I'm gonna keep like trying to like slam into the glass with my hands, obviously not doing anything, and out of desperation, I'm gonna take my sword and just say, "Let me go!" and then throw out my last guiding bolt. All right. And it's gonna be nice a wave team. of just pure, just black energy with a mix of um, a little white light shimmering in it. Mm -hmm. Remember it, Kretzler 19. Yep. Please, please. Oh. And I will add uh, my inspiration. Mm -hmm. Yeah, go ahead. The D12 or D20? I don't Which have one? any D20s. I have D12. D12 yeah. okay. And I need... Uh, I need, I need He's got no game. reaction, so he cannot do shield, so you know that already. So you need just, a... Just roll the d12 and go with it, man. 17. Okay, 17 unfortunately just misses, I'm sorry. Almost. Ah, don't worry about it. Almost. That's By the end one. of my turn. Damn. Okay. Oh, that was my... Did I say that mm -hmm. at third level or did I say first? I think I said third. It's fine. Third. Don't worry. It was third. Yep. Yeah. Okay. That's the end of my turn. Uh, I'm just standing there. I'm going to keep taking the sword and just chipping away at the, the glass. At the end of your turn, uh, Sadimos will focus his mind and try to enter your mind, Aki, as you are very close to the scissors and the body of Bruce on the floor. And um, he will try to... Um, you, s you will see as he kind of concentrates, silvery kind of mist appears underneath you. I need you to make a dexterity saving throw as he casts one more on Holy Flames. Oh dear. Fuck. Oh, oh damn. Okay. As uh, you fell, it, you take uh, some necrotic damage as you see your skin Shoot. blackening around you hmm. from the mist uh, as you take 17 points of necrotic damage. Sure. Um, anything else? No, that's uh, it. Yep, cool, cool. Or all, all right, and that will finish this uh, legendary action. Okay. At the beginning of your of the round, you see the obelisk vibrate as it begins to siphon in the energy of the remaining tethered uh, circles. Aki, make a fate roll. I will tell you <laughs> now. If you fail, then you'll have to make another roll to determine which of the two, your mother or the bugbear, will be siphoned into the obelisk. If you pass, Jesus. then one of the dwarves will be siphoned, sparing your family. Even though it's not nice, someone is going to get siphoned into it. Okay, so that's me not sleeping tonight. Uh, <laughs> hi. It happens. Mommy! Okay. Uh, now I need you to roll me a d4. You decide your mother to be odds or even. <laughs> Just flip a coin. Flip a coin. Oh, so much pressure. I'm sorry well, for this, guys. My family's odd. 
odd. Okay. Mum is odd. So let's hope this is even. Sorry, bugbear. Oh, oh it is even. even so. <laughs> and you all see the obelisk vibrate, and then you hear the shrieking pain and the last echoes of the bugbear as you all knew him very briefly as Doden Thok gets siphoned into the obelisk and as he does disappear Ziggy, it's your turn um, gonna bonus action third level healing words, Bruce yep 18 points of healing. I'm back up then. And then I'm going to use 20 feet of movement to... Oh wait, no, sorry. 15 feet of movement. Uh, to get in range of... Uh, Errols. And heal him with a... With my action. A... Regular healing potion. Oh, oh yeah, because I gave him those. Thank you. Well, I, I had one anyway, but yeah. Yeah. I'll... I'll... I'll oh. take it. I'm not going to complain. Yeah. No, 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 Luke, thank you. Honestly. Six points of healing. That's all I can do. Thank you. Kill, kill that fucking leech. No, I will deal with the leech later. That's, I just, it's important I don't get my soul sucked. It's my bonus action and action done. I can't do anything. Thank you, Luke. Turn. You did good. Thank you. That was a great fucking turn. I don't feel all that great. I'm alive, thanks to you. <laughs> so, okay, so I'm guessing it's uh, Zadimus' turn next. Yeah. Uh, Sadimus has a little tiny predicament ongoing. Because actually, is he on melee with you, Yagu? He yeah, is, right? Yes. Yeah, yeah, he's on the ground. That's, yeah. Yeah, that's the problem. Okay. But you are very wounded, right? He can see that. So oh, I'm will... almost full. <laughs> <laughs> so he will like, try to recharge be so his much tentacle. Uh, so he'll think, okay, I cannot disengage, so I better kill him. But yep, he does not recharge it. So instead, uh, you will feel once more the floor beneath you uh, starts to wraith with flames. Um, I need you to make a dexterity saving throw. Me? Uh, no, Yagu. Yagu. Yeah. Oh. He's trying to get rid of okay. Yagu so he can move towards you uh, next. <laughs> no more than 18. No more than 18. No more than okay. 18. Okay. All right. So I'll roll it as you. Okay. Come on. I wanna be. I don't know. That's more so, than 18. Yep. Okay. <laughs> plus, wait, 12 plus 13, so that's 12. And then 12 half, that's 6, right? Yeah, so, I'm on 4 HP. Yeah. So I needed it to be less than 18, then it would have been half to. Yeah, you get it. Okay. okay. And as so you will take a nap. And as you fall, uh, he will actually literally walk uh, kind of like over. Not literally over your, over you, but yeah, uh, he will move uh, his movement uh, all the way here to to the edge of the space of the sinkhole. Just there, not getting into it. Yep, just there. And then from there, he will assess the situation, and once more, he will uh, just use his psychic ability to this time on you, Aki. Uh, and do a psychic whisper on your direction. That'll be a 23 to hit. Yeah, that hits. Over the barbs. Ooh. Okay, so uh, so that'll be a 12. So I'll re-roll that. So I'll do it here. Aki has the advantage. Oh. <gasps> okay, nope. I thought it was a natural one. It just got stuck between a 13 and a 1 in the line mm. there. I don't know if you guys can see it, but yeah, no, it's a 13, mm. so that will still hit. Uh, and as he does, uh, uh, let me roll damage. Sorry, I lost it. Oh, yeah. This is quite a bit. Okay, I got a message from. Um, okay. Yeah. Cool, cool. So that will be 24 plus 4, so 28 points of damage. Uh, and I need you to make a charisma saving throw um, as well, Aki. Yeah, it's, it's an advantage. Yeah. Advantage because of the barbs. 
Which means it's straight. Yep. That's fine. That's better than disadvantage. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh. I mean, yeah. Oh, wow. Okay, cool. So you feel like uh, that you were going to be stunned, but uh, but you managed to overcome it. And and you can see at this point, as Sadimos is moving and walking, his bones are kind of like he's shambling almost, even though the mm -hmm. ritual seems to be completed or partially completed. He's very wounded. Sorry, you and said that was, so that was half. So it was it was twelve points of damage I took, right? Not twenty-four. Yeah, I mean you succeeded, right? On the uh, no, it's well, an it's an attack. So yeah, he hit you. So yeah, no, no, it's uh, the normal. So with thir <laughs> we thought I thought you said it was a thirteen. He didn't hit me. No, it's yeah, 13, 13 plus his ah. modifier plus eleven. Yeah. So so it, it, so it was twenty-four points of damage. Twenty-four. Yeah. yeah. Sorry for that. Okay. Yep. And that will finish Sadimos' uh, turn. Oh, lair action! <laughs> yeah. Bruce! Uh, nope, Yagu, we roll d6. Roll a d6, okay. A two! two. A two two! Uh, I think this one is a silence one again. Uh, the two, I believe so, yeah. Let me double check very quickly. It is the voice thief. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, boy, Steve. He has to. He has to stop Aki. He already used it on him, though. <laughs> yeah, and it wasn't effective. And Ziggy was the last person to heal people. So he looked towards you, Ziggy, and he will silence you. Your mouth skits, shut and glued, and you are silenced until the next round. No way. No way of fighting us. No, this happens just to uh, one person okay. without any saves. However, well, I use my action anyway, so it's fine. Yes. Uh, the parasites um, begin moving towards you, Ruin, and you notice huh? that they can also float. And as they hover huh? up towards you, only one of them reaches you. The rest of them, uh, the rest of them are slightly behind, but one of them is going to try latching itself to you. Uh, does a 15 hit? Nope. Nope. Well, that's it. They can fucking float. They can fucking float. Right. Damn it. Alright, so Aki, your turn. Aki, Flamacaster. I suggest going yes. for the scissors by wasting 15 yes. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hold on. Hold on. So, um, Aki can't talk anyway. There's nothing else he can do. You can talk now, so, um, by the way. I can. No, it's over. Yeah, because he That's casted over. on Ziggy. Yep. That's nice. So um, Aki will go uh, kind of round the outside as much as he can to... Can I occupy the same space as my mum or not? She's yeah, underneath she's under. Yeah. yeah, she's under. Great. Yeah, yeah, in which case, uh, 10 feet of movement, pick up the scissors. Mm -hmm. And from where I am, I can reach the sigil here. Yes. Snip, snippity snip. Zoop. <laughs> Yeah, the lightning conjuration around you de dissipates the bubble um kind of disappears you see him wince and and struggle in pain once more um and you feel like you've broken another step through his process and you feel like your mother um and you also see the we the other tethers now begin to kind of show themselves as well and they seem to be a lot weaker and you suspect that Another effect that he's been doing has been nullified. Potentially, he's healing. Nice. Um, was it takes my action to snip, or it takes a bonus action and interaction, or what? Action to snips. Action to snips. Snippity. Snip. Um, then I'm going to uh, snippity. Uh, you quicken. see, just to make it uh, to make it more uh, to make you not more nervous. You see that Sadimos is starts to cast something, and as you look up for a second, you see another black hole kind of effect. It starts to open above you. That will happen as a legendary action right after your turn. Right, there is bugger all I can do to stop that. It's actually you something you recognize because it's a spell you use before yourself. He's about no, he's about to dimension door. He's about to do a hole into the space that is gonna pull mm. you. You start feeling the pull of the hole pulling you towards it. 
and Bruce. He's opening it above me or above himself? Above, above you. Above you and Bruce. So you feel it there. There is like a, some kind of gravity portal opening there that is going to pull you right after your turn, potentially. Uh, <laughs> um, looking at Bruce, can I tell uh, what kind of nick Bruce is in? Um, badly hurt, but uh, up and ready to fight. In which case, Aki's going to back off his remaining movement uh, as far away from, I don't know, as far away from the opening point you can see for this. Uh, and he's going to uh, vortex warp Bruce right on uh, right on top of Fuckface. Is there a bonus Ooh. action to vortex warp? He's going to quicken it and spend the last of his sorcery points to do so. Okay. I'll go here. You can get us all up in his business, however, wherever you like. I only have to put you somewhere that can suspend your weight, so I could just stick you to stick you to his face at this point if you'd like. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think it achieves anything with okay. my turn now. <laughs> on, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Good, let's do it. There we go. Okay. Cool, cool. Uh, and you, yeah. And as that happens, uh, anything else from you? Uh. No, just he's backing off and backing off and staring at his mum on the floor. Um, absolutely convinced that this is how he's going to die. <laughs> is, yeah, that where gonna, is that where you want to be, Bruce? Is that where you're going to be vortex warped to? I'm, I'm presuming it I'm could, away from the effect of this thing. Yeah, it can be anywhere. I mean, I, I've got the range to put you anywhere. Then there's fine. Then there's fine. Yes. Next turn, let's go. Okay. Okay. Um... As I describe, uh, once more, you feel this gravity sinkhole start to pull both of you towards it. Uh, as he casts that spell, using two of his legendary actions to do that. So I need Bruce and you, Aki, to make a constitution saving throw. Oof. For this? That's odd. Here we go. 17. You recognize this, well, you've gathered this spell is uh, Graviturgy what? magic. That is quite unusual. Hmm. Okay. Okay. Uh, so they save DC 17. Okay, so you both pass, uh, I believe. Yeah, yeah just mm -hmm. passed so you will take half of the damage and you guys are not pulled towards the hole let me just make sure let me actually display the the spell as you guys do just make it easy two two so two, two 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 yep all right that's half fine to 17? so half yeah half to 17 yeah and if you are raging you will get another half i am not raging oh oh, oh. oh. i'm still up okay Ooh. yep wow all right, okay. and that will finish on his last uh, legendary action for this round as well, because he used to. Oh no, he's got one, one more still. Okay, okay. Yeah, go. Yeah, that's safe. By the power of L. Dot, I grant you another net twenty, please. Nope. Okay. Oh, I forgot to put it in. Sorry. That's okay. <laughs> Bruce, you're up. Oh my god. I'm not. I've haste has dropped. I can't move. Move on. Oh. <gasps> Oh yeah, the... Gerald, you're up. I'm about to be the only one. Right. So, but it's fine. I'm just gonna make my turn quick. So I'm gonna stand up, uh, grab my bow, and uh, just use um, Zephyr here to uh, make it advantage. So I'll just post that in the chat real quick. Yep. Give me one moment. Ruin your Zephyr. Next, so. There Disney. you are. Yep. Okay. Well, I'll send you something. Just and uh, basically, I'm just gonna use my 20 plus 30, so that's 50 feet of movement, just to be about right here-ish. Yep. So I'm gonna use 35 feet of movement that I'm granted with Zephyr, and I'm just gonna just take just two sharpshooter shots. That is it. Actually, just regular shots, not sharpshooter. Okay. Two regular shots at him with my bow. Okay. Before right. you before mm -hmm. you make the attack, you see that Sadimo is full of cuts and wounds, and every time he's more and more damaged, and he, pieces of him keep falling off. Uh, go and make your attacks. Okay. All right. So now, 
I just realized that should have been an advantage. Can I roll the attack roll again? Mm -hmm. Yeah. That should have been because of Zephyr, yeah. Mm -hmm. So, sorry about that. So you use the, the advantage one, yeah, no. So this is the advantage one, which is the 20, dirty 20. And the damage is 10 plus 3 acid plus the 4 from Zephyr. So that's 17 total for that for that hit. Okay. How much and is the total, you said? So 17, because 4 from Zephyr... <laughs> Three from acid and ten from piercing. Okay. Didn't you say you used as well? Oh no, you didn't in the end. Okay. Nope, not yet. And then um, I'm gonna use a second strike. So I'm just. This is gonna be a normal roll. Uh, and with that fifteen, I'm going to use my last D12. So I'm gonna add the D12 to that one to hit. I can't see what that is. That's a 9, so 15 plus 9, that's 24 to hit. And with that one on hit, I'm going to use Favored Foe to add some extra damage to it. Okay. So I'm just going to be on 20 that. And it's a D6 at this point. So whatever damage is there, just add a D6 to it, which is what okay. it's going to show right now. It's not a lot, but it's something. All right, so just to go through it, the damage is six yeah, plus three. Yeah, the last one, yeah, because he's very crucial. Yeah, so it's six plus three, that's nine, plus okay. an extra two, so that's 11 total damage to him. All right, with he actually had 10 hit points. <laughs> as I was smiling. Oh, <laughs> as you actually used mm -hmm. that. That die just make the difference. You yep. see the arrow, and you know with your battle experience, Herald, this is gonna kill this creature again because he's very dead already. <laughs> yep. How would you like to oh. kill him? Fucking so hell! Basically, Herald, he's gonna get up with his bow, see the situation as he's standing up. Zephyr, he's gonna like go like in a straight line behind the obelisk, the monolith, draw an arrow. Have the first one hit his little larval parasite in the chest and burn a big ass hole through it. Then I imagine as his head is looking down, spitting some black acid, he'll say like, heads up. And then he'll <laughs> a second shot, which that shot disintegrates. Errol's eyes turns into a cat as he readjusts at the last second. And that arrow will turn into a green ball. It'll go right into his eye and blow out the back of his head. On the last yeah. second, just deep within mm -hmm. your mind you you hear you cannot stop Vecna but he just falls like yep. oh, and collapses stop, and stop you little bitch <laughs> he does like this kind of like <laughs> and kind of sounds Man. like a, almost like a dying cat and he slowly starts vanishing into green goo like this until it's only a blob of goo left all right and that's the end of Errol's turn. That's it. I don't want to keep anybody any longer. So, yep. We need to finish now anyway. Mm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. And <clears throat> as that happens, I think actually that will be the perfect time to finish tonight's session as you guys defeated our arch enemy, the strongest enemy you fought. Well done, guys. Ecclesia Sadimos Fang is no more and potentially everything has ended. Only one casualty, I'm sorry for your bugbear caravan companion. Aki. Who's that guy again? I don't oh. know what you're talking about. Oh. But, uh, he was lovely, but you know, at least uh, everyone else survived and justice has been made and heroes have won as they were meant to. And as you find yourselves in this far realm sky, completely destroyed with this monolith that just completely has become just pitch black looking almost a magical not humming or vibrating anymore we'll end tonight's session thank you very much or all of you <laughs> for you. watching uh <laughs> thank you players uh for putting up with this super tense thing uh i hope you enjoyed it watching at home that was painful and uh thanks for being there and happy birthday again mark and see you guys tomorrow thanks to darren curtis and uh, james webster for the music and art and we will be tomorrow here same time same place on the eye of observation take care uh, thanks for watching stay magical Bye. and take it easy all of that <laughs> Bye. Bye.